talking best ofs, Dawn is responsible for the best ofs these days. Unfortunately, due to work commitments, Teal had to uh, step down from editing things. So at the moment, our primary editors are Dawn and Tomzy. Our primary game captor. There. Okay. This is why I'm red, because it's, it's... Ah, why are you doing that? Okay, I guess it's just spooky. Look how spooky it is. Are you spooked? Desync, I don't believe you. <laughs> uh... Okay. The best is you to come out in August. Yep, yep. New shift. Okay, let's just make a joke out of everything and then I won't be scared, right? I'm so glad it's almost over. Congratulations, sweetie. <laughs> Thank you. I'll never understand why you chose such a macabre field, There's nothing but... disturbing about it. It's just but that I... I'm proud of you. <laughs> I really am. You've come so far. So, you haven't told me what's next. Will you get a job where you are, or...? They actually have everyone they need. Why is she way louder than her mom? teacher, Mr. Delver, transferred me to his office to finalize my internship there. Or are they animated oh, like puppets? Well, Apparently good. it's just one person really working on it. Mentioning him. Where's he located? He said solo dev team. Are you away from me? <laughs> no. No. I'm not moving. He's actually located around here. Ah, her mouth. River Fields. Oh, Rebecca. I don't like that. Grandma. Even oh, I Grandma. Sorry. About that place. I'd just be worried people about you. make up stories. Death is a scary thing to a lot of people. And we try to explain things we don't understand, and we want comfort when we lose someone we love. I mean, no one's embalming any ghost bodies or whatever. It's fine. Right, right. I'm sorry. <laughs> Their but mouths are wonderful. I to give this <laughs> anyway. So. <gasps> Satanic yeah. Hobo! Thank you for the 68 months! Welcome back! It's good to see you. I'm doing well, how are I, you? I don't know if I want that. Just take it, please. It should be yours anyway. I doubt it was mo -capped. What is it? Touch Thanks. it. <laughs> Alright, enough spooky stuff. Zwish! I'm so proud of you. When is all this happening? When so I start? thought that the monsters move funny to be spooky, but actually it might just be a quirk of Mine the way that this game tomorrow. is animated. Her hair actually looks like, you know, when people add modded hairstyles to Dragon Age Inquisition, it kind of looks like someone just took an existing hairstyle and started pulling planes out in, into different places. No, I don't think it's a particularly high budget game. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Those optimization issues, though. Wait! Wait! I limited your frames! Why are you doing that? Stop it! Stop it! Alright. Here we go. Fucking video game. Okay. Sensitivity is okay. I saw someone having massive sensitivity issues. I think I'm gonna have to cap the game even further. Cause... Yeah. Okay. It is very badly optimized. <laughs> All right, options. If I do this, do you think it'll like cap it down? Probably not. What is that? It might cap it down. Are we still just chatting? Oh, we might be because I'm bad at streaming. Hold on. The mortuary assistant. Da, 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 da. You are muted? I don't think I am. <laughs> if I do that, does it cap? No cap. Okay. I like how even when I prep in advance, I still end up having to tab out or like quit out and fuck with the frame rate.
Let me let me exit you. Why do I have to look at the splashes every time? Okay. Um... All right, Nvidia control panel. 3D settings, program settings. Jinx, thanks! Thank you for the four months, welcome back. That's one thing I don't like about the fact that I do VTubing stuff now. Every single game is just like, hey, let me let me have take issue with uh with VTube Studio. You don't mind, do you? Cause if a game capped out my graphics card before, it didn't really matter unless it was like literally a hundred percent and there was nothing left to encode with. Now it matters because I'm running a VTuber as well. Uh, PC gaming is fun. I actually haven't used my capture card in so long that I don't think it's set up right now. Oh. Times possessed. Wait, what? <laughs> I don't want to be possessed. My VTuber is only running at 60 flips. 30 flips looks weird. Oh, there's just volume. Huh, alright. Well, you can go all the way down there, buddy. Did that just make it louder? I feel like that just made it louder, what the fuck? Oh, it's also not... Frick. So every time you relaunch an executable... Every time you relaunch an executable, you have to readjust your screen lighting. Because it's now like a different window, I guess. There we go. That flicker is immensely irritating. I don't like that at all. All right. Here we go. Legitimately, I think that made it louder. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> okay, that is quieter. Let me just reset the- I'll do it in the Windows control panel. Koshi Uma, thank you for the 27 months. Welcome back. There's nothing quite like the experience of playing an indie horror game because they're all immensely jank. Okay, my... F my mouse sensitivity is still butts. That'll do. Everything is vibrating. That's probably fine. <laughs> oh. Oh. <gasps> Oh, is everything vibrating because you can re uh, touch everything and, and the physics is going to shit itself? Oh, what? Nope. Nope. Can't touch that. <coughs> okay. Okay. Do you see how everything's kind of vibrating as I move? Pencil. Used to sign the paperwork left on the door. Oh. Okay. Ah! Access quick imagery and choose the item you wish to use. Most but not all places where items can be used will cause the item icon to disappear. To, sorry, to appear. Wait, but why wouldn't it ever cause... Okay. You guys can't see it? Then that's fine. I'll just deal with it. Motion sickness is fine. Can I steal a stapler? No. Okay. Oh, the demon's gonna fuck around with the fuses. Why would you hang this portrait up? <laughs> it's terrifying. I, I don't know what this button means. Okay, whatever. Rebecca, one last thing I forgot to give to you. Please grab a pencil from my desk and sign. Good luck. Okay. Oh, it's that's the item icon, I see. Okay.
I think I found out why the performance is such butts. <laughs> Whoa. Was all this grass necessary? <laughs> it does look immensely furry, doesn't it? Rebecca. Oh my fuck! Wait, perfect timing. Why are you so loud? I just finished with Mr. Dalton here. Please wheel him back to cold storage and bring us Mrs. Page. Moving the deceased. Okay, but let me turn it down because holy shit. <laughs> Why are you so loud, Mr. Mortuary Man? There you go. Use the gurney by standing behind it and pressing the gurney interact key. Then walk backwards with the gurney down the hall. Why do I specifically have to walk backwards? Oh god. Sir? Sir, your house is demons. Computer locked. I toss all this shit out the window. What was his background? I didn't see. Hold on. <laughs> he works in a mortuary, so clearly he needs, like, some kind of generic cliche as shit horror background. Um, Mrs. Page, please. Awkward. Okay. Use gurney. Is this? Oh, he, oh, okay. <laughs> okay, I wanted to try and turn around. I am now actually immediately stuck. Okay, no, we're, we're good. I got it. I got it. Let me reverse down this whole way here. Something is definitely going to grab me from behind at some point, isn't it? To bring the body in or out of cold storage, open the bay with the body's name, pull out the rack, and then move the cart over to it. Okay. All right. Get in there, Mr. Dalton. Oh, do I have to pull out? Hold on. Can I swing Mr. Dalton in circles? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna piss off the demons. All right. Wait, left mouse button. Oh, fucking gurney's in the way. Get over there, Mr. G Mr. Dalton, Mr. Kearney. Perfect. Nailed it. In, in you, in, 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 in you, in, no, no, in you go. In you go. Nailed it. Okay, so now we put the gurney underneath, underneath. The gurney is very sensitive. Gurney underneath. Leon Chafal, thank you for the eight months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. And then we open this up. Hello, Mrs. Whatever your name was. And then I hit the gurney button. Oh, fuck me. Okay. I shut this. Use the gurney. I'm trying to make sure that I'm sitting way back from the microphone, just in case I squeak. All right. I'm just finishing up something here. Okay. So why don't you grab the clipboard and start recording identifying marks? Oh, I'll get out of okay. your way when you're done and let you hop in here. Cavity fluid. Wait, what's cavity fluid? <gasps> Leon Chafal, thank you for giving the get to sub to the law dog. Thank you, thank you. It's very kind. If I shut all the windows the, or the doors, the demons can't get me, right? Okay, clipboard used for forms and keeping back track of mortuary tasks. It's a large item, apparently. Inspect bodies for identifying marks that enter into a computer. Mix and bomb in fluid. Make an incision in the carteroid. Car 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 oh, fuck. C carotid, carotid artery and jugular vein. Ew, I don't want to do that part. I, I regret my decision to work here. Oh god. Dorothy Page, age 87. 
I like how we have a clipboard full of information about like how the body works. It's just head, left shoulder, right shoulder. Oh, what's wrong with your legs? Inspecting a body. However, the cursor over unique markings such as mole scratches, bruises, and interact with them to record them to the clipboard. There's a scratch. I see it. I'm on the wrong leg. Hold on. Back. Look at the leg. Yeah. That's the demon scratch. I did it! Hmm. These old windows never stay latched. <laughs> Got a mole. Mole, 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 mole. Dude, I thought she just fucking got up on her own. That was horrifying. Don't do that. She's she's still <laughs> rotating. She's got she's got something there. Do you see it? Got she's got a thing. Those are the demon demon boils. MDMK, thank you for the four months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Oh. Well that's weird. I don't like that. Hello. Oh, I hate everything about this. Uh, looks mostly normal. Can I shut her eyes? <laughs> I open the window. Uh, I don't really see anything else. The demon didn't do too much attacking. I have a feeling this guy's gonna leave me here because, like, it wouldn't be nearly as scary if he's here the entire time. <gasps> Great. Climb on in here and put everything into the record system. Don't forget to take the print out to the front desk so Zoe can add it to the packet for the family. After that, we'll get started. I wasn't paying attention to what he asked me to do. Hello. I am computer. Oh my god. To enter cadaver information, click the record system icon to open the program. Fire. What was that? I didn't say anything. You all right? Y yeah, I'm fine. Sorry. Okay. Um, match the corresponding sections on your clipboard to the corresponding sections on the computer. Once all the findings have been entered into the system, click submit to print out embalming records and file the records up front to begin the embalming. Okay. Welcome aboard. <gasps> Masamune! Thank you for giving the gift of stuff to Mountain Dew! Thank you, thank you! I didn't realize he was here. I scroll up, find the message, it just says FEET in all caps. Of course it does. Thank you very much! Night shift. Oh. Record system. <laughs> Name. Dorothy Page. Age. 87. Head. <laughs> Namke. <laughs> One shoulder, mild abrasion. No, no, no. My, 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 no, that's a leg. Fuck. <laughs> I can read. Left shoulder, mild abrasion. Right arm. Contusion. Left arm. Blemishes. Left leg, mild abrasion. Is that it? Did I miss anything? Uh, right shoulder, right leg. Yeah, no, we're good. We're good. Head, no thanks. <laughs> well. <laughs> hey. A packet of mortuary paperwork related to the handling of the deceased. File up front so they are available if requested. Okay. 
I'm going up front. Just going up front by myself. What creepy things could possibly be up front? Time to embalm. <laughs> Time to embalm. All right. I've set everything out so you can just go ahead and get started. I'll be monitoring. Everything's yep. on your list there if you need it. The game is real loud. Like, I have it turned way down, and I still feel like it's really loud. Let me do it again. Maybe I'm just anticipating how loud it's going to be when a jump scares me. Okay. Wire jaw shut with needle injection and settings needles. I'm not going to like this, am I? This was a mistake. Needle injector. Wow. Used for hammering setting needle barbs into the skull. Oh, that sounds, <laughs> sounds delightful. Uh, Moisturizing wipe. What's this? Setting needles. Yeah, that's what I need. Perfect. Hey. <laughs> thank you for the hundred bits. Thank you, thank you. Uh, pull the manipulator up and press the injector button to drive barbs into the skull, then twist the wire shut to close- twist the wires to shut the jaw. I hate that. <laughs> uh... <laughs> um... Oh! Oh! <laughs> Godfather, thank you for the two months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. There we go. Oh, she's not grimacing at me anymore. That's nice. Okay, insert eye caps to keep eyes shut. Ugh. EVC tubing... Eye caps! Used for holding eyelids shut. Nice. Wait, that's because they don't... The eyes don't actually stay shut, right? Is the horror just in having to do this shit? Okay. We good? Nope. I didn't properly insert these eye caps. Oh no! Oh no, no! No, it won't close! Ah! I hate it! Oh, I hate it! Ah! Oh, okay, I figured it out. Right. <laughs> Jeff Berkey, thank you for the sub! I put waffles in her eyes, it's fine now. Thank you, thank you! Mix in embalming fluid in pump. Is this the pump? Hello, are you a pump? Okay. Glutaraldehyde. Glutaraldehyde. Cavity fluid. That's not what I want. Yeah, the demon can't haunt me if it's got waffles in its eyes. Glu glu child was this there that one all right <gasps> stop it hmm. <laughs> sometimes we get chemicals that haven't been stored properly and just and can make them pop like that just jump straight off just the fucking shelves keep doing your thing I'll get it off you go then go get it he's like hmm <laughs> how strange okay put in the glutes or whatever. Then... Methanol. Nope. Don't want that. Methanol. Perfect. And then... Hum... Hume humectant? Uh, yeah, that. Retaining moisture. 
Did it. Formaldehyde. I assume that's the last one that I need. Yeah. What happens if I start jump dumping random chemicals in there? Perfect. I did it. Are you gonna clean that shit up? Okay, make an incision and... Okay, I need a scalpel. Are you a scalpel? Yeah. Okay, so I gotta make... Oh, I don't want to make an incision. That sounds awful. <sighs> ah. Some items need to be used directly on the body to use an item, open, and select the item needed. I wasn't... But can we... <laughs> Put the clipboard in there. No, okay. Okay, use forceps to clamp tubing and connect to a bombing pump. Okay. Who made me play this? I thought the concept was interesting, but then I didn't think about the fact that I, I, I failed biology because I didn't want to do any dissections. <laughs> Oops. Flexible, durable tubing used for medic various medical applications. I'm not dissecting. I mean, I'm cutting her up. Uh, what did I need? Forceps? What are these? Tro trochire. No, that's not right. What is this? Skizzers? Oh, forceps. There we go. I was like, I got an itchy ear. Creaky headset. There we go. Alright. People do this stuff in real life. Can you imagine how it's like? I just I can't get over like how it would smell. Okay. I put forceps and the tubing. Oh, that's that's delightful. Okay, now I gotta drain the body. Is this messing up my brand safety score? <laughs> I like Snuffy's new newest sign, the little Miss Brandrisk thing. He hasn't given me a single piece of feedback. He's just staring at me. Perfect. Fill an empty IV reservoir bag with cavity fluid, then insert into the abdominal cavity. Ooh. Guardian of the Lilies, thank you for the 38 months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Okay, that's a fluid bag. Yep. Perfect. Oh, no, 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 yes. And I think I need that too. What the fuck is this? Moisturizing wipe. Mo used to moisturize the skin of the deceased. Is it specifically only for the deceased? All right, reservoir bag. Okay. Da, da, da. Insert the choker until it stops to begin the flow of embalming fluid. Once that cavity is full, pull it back, rotate it, and then reinsert until the bag is empty. That sounds disgusting. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> uh. Fill her up! Perfect. <laughs> okay, found the last part. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Mix cleaners in bathroom closet to create tank cleaner, then pour into the embalming pump. 
Apply moisturizer to facial features. Okay. Go into the bathroom. Check your corners. What if I don't check my corners, though? Will I save myself some trouble and not get jump scared if I just am re re <laughs> relentlessly ignorant? I am absolutely getting jump scared in here at some point. Egg. <laughs> Prince T. Simi, thank you for the hundred bits. Thank you, thank you. Add descaler to create the mixture. Okay. Cleaner base. I can't hold anything else. Okay, apparently I've just made it. That's fine then. Uh, pour into the embalming pump. Was it that thing there? Hey! You still haven't cleaned up your shit. For... Um... That might not have been right. Because it's it's just... It just fripped at me and I haven't got a checklist. Shit. No, no, we're good. All right, I need to moisturize her. Oh god, her body's jiggling. <laughs> I'm missing something. Move the wipe across facial facial features while holding down interact until the lotion is used up. Hey, hey, beautiful. Uh, how do I? Oh, did I not actually pick up the moisturizer? Hold on. Oh, wait, no, I. Yeah, okay, no, here it is. I was just cleaning the pump, that makes sense. Okay. Moisturizing. Tell you what. I think what? your moisturizer expired. Why don't you go ahead and head out. I'll take over from here. Are you in on this? Uh, are you sure? I, I just got here. Don't worry. You're doing great. I'll get the last of your paperwork sorted today and call you in for your first shift. <laughs> I think he's conspiring. He's like, tell you what. <laughs> you seem to be seeing some zombies, so why don't you take the day off? It's just a little demonic possession. Go ahead. It's fine. I'll give you a call when we get someone in. I wasn't paying attention to where he wanted me to go anyway. Am I just leaving? I'm going home. Goodbye. <laughs> It was just really weird. <laughs> so some stuff fell over. That's not a big deal. And no, I know. and a corpse it turned into a zombie and something it's whispered that I was going to die. Were you not paying that. attention? I'm just really worried. He was supposed to finalize my stuff today. And he said he would, right? Yeah. So that's a good thing. Yeah. It just didn't feel like he meant it. Like, like he just said it to get me out of the building. Wait a sec, I have another Stream call. has cozy tag? Are you implying it's not? Hello? Hey, Rebecca. It's Raymond. Oh, hi, Mr. Delver. Uh, look, if I did anything wrong today, just... No, no. Uh, I wanted to apologize. You've done a fantastic job. <laughs> just not feeling too well. <gasps> He's possessed! That's uh, actually why I'm calling. I know it's late, but we just got three new cadavers, and no one else can make it in right now. I was hoping you could come in and take care of them. Well, uh, yeah. Uh, are you sure? I mean, of course. <laughs> Excellent. You're doing me a huge favor. He's sacrificing me to the demons. I took care of the rest of your onboarding. We're all set. And your new badge is in your personal belongings drawer in the back room. That's great. Uh, thank you. I I'm on my way right now. I hope you feel better. Thanks again. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Holy shit. That was him. He signed me on. He needs me to come in tonight. See? I told you it was fine. Congratulations. It's probably Thanks. a bit quiet because the audio mixing like, is kind of dicky. Right and some shit's later. really loud, so I turned it all down because I don't want to get screamed at at like uh, 10 dBs or something. Key finding simulator? Also, I feel like it keeps resetting my mouse sensitivity. Oh, it do that's because it does. <laughs> Good. There we go.
The nicest people are dead. Do you have to get like shirts like this if you work in, in a morgue? Found my keys, but I'm gonna look at all our shit first. A book about the history of preservation and how people use it to cope with death. When sleep when when coping with the loss of a loved one, how do you move on? For many, seeing the memory of their loved one preserved helps ob helps obtain a sense of closure. But when did we begin the process of preservation? How does the embalming process of today differ from the methods of the past? In this work by Radwell, we explore the history and methods of embalming and preservation. When we embalm, we preserve love. All right. Did he just say they're gonna continue playing the same song? What is this microwave? <laughs> Let me just squat to use donut stuff. Yeah, let's go. This product. <laughs> this pro. This pro. <laughs> this product. Something. Something. Water. When something and hands wet. It doesn't taste very good. <laughs> I can't read the rest. The, the, the last bit just says, you'll never. It just says, you'll never. Is this a threat? Donut coffee not actually made from donuts. Calvin no one. Thank you for the 49 months. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Alright. Whatever. Da -da -da. Da -da -da. Kind of tastes like leaves with sticks. Our goal is to make the most wholesome cereal just like grandma used to make 400 years ago. We harvest the fallen leaves of our oak trees deep in the full months and dry them by hand to achieve that crunch we all love. After removing the sticks, we grind our leaves and add the sticks back in. This process ensures the same great natural bits enjoyed by humans and horses alike. That seems like a parody somehow. Ow, I just... I just hit myself in the crunch with the fridge. Alright. Happy tofu! I mean, this is, like, a lot of that is vegan food and then there's milk there. <laughs> Wolfios. There's food in here. 110 calories. Wow. Moth bombs. This product contains chemicals known into every state to cause different kinds of bowel obstructions eventually resulting in death. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. It's got bees in it. A cereal that does not have bees in it. <laughs> what if bees are in cereal? After multiple recalls spanning multiple decades, the Oku Okuo formula has been adjusted to fit our changing times. We are proud to say that it does not contain bees. Oh, look, it's Grandma. She looks just as horrifying here as she did in the opening scene. Am I doing this so I don't have to deal with creepy dead people? I'm actually half expecting the game to just insist on spawning a dead person in here to get me moving. second. I can hear Leon downstairs. He's going, bleep, bleep. Because he forgets that he's a dog and sometimes thinks that he is a bird. Look at this ridiculous grass. 
<laughs> Look at it. <laughs> you... Why? Uh, whatever. All right. Guess I'll head to the back and get started. <gasps> hey. You want to come in? The game is lagging. Hi, Rebecca. <sighs> Mr. Delver, I need help. Someone's outside the mortuary. Just try to stay calm. I know you're scared. <gasps> I'll unlock the door in a moment. What? This is very sudden, but listen to me. <gasps> have to start right away. Raymond, you bastard. I'm sorry. Look, this isn't funny. Stop. You need to take this seriously. You need to act quickly. This is insane. I'll just leave. I'll, I'll just fucking leave. You can't leave, Rebecca. I, I can't allow that for you or for others. It's far too dangerous. <laughs> what am I supposed to do then? Most bodies I work with at night are fine. So we stay calm. Okay? We embalm, file the paperwork, everything. Treat it like a normal day. Staying focused will help. I left some things for you on the desk. I'll call again when you get to the embalming room. No, wait. Ugh. Damn it. What the fuck? This is insane. What a dick, dude. Okay. This is so stupid. It's just some hazing for the new girl or something. Just, <laughs> just play along and do your job. Would, would you ever play along and do your job rather than just, like, busting open a window and piecing out? Tape recorder. Old key. Old key. I'm fucking quitting tomorrow. I mean, who does something like this? Telephone. All right, listen carefully. I'm, look, I'm sorry, but this entire thing is extremely unprofessional. If this is how you treat new hires, I don't think I can work for you. This isn't funny. Rebecca, you don't have to believe me, but I hope you do before it's too late. The only way to save yourself is to banish the demon before you're too far gone. To do that, you will need to learn the demon's name, bind it to its chosen body, and burn it in the retort. <sighs> I know this is a lot to take in. I wish I could do more for you. I had years to learn what I know. You have hours. <sighs> I've recorded a number of cassettes to instruct you in the hope that having a physical object with a known message will help you stay grounded. I won't be calling again. You can't trust the phones. Anything can be manipulated. Listen to the tapes. Learn the demon's name. Burn the correct body. The most important thing in the room is in that cabinet. Wait. Open it up. Which cabinet? This Good one? Good luck, Rebecca. I'm sorry this had to happen. <sighs> this is insane. Whatever. Just be the professional one, grab a body, and get started. Toby Wan Kenobi, thank you for the eight months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Mini cassette tape. The process of possession. At every moment, the demon is funneling its energy through you, weakening you until you are unable to resist. Identifying a demonic entity is a delicate Shin balance. Shinkai, thank you for the 25 months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. The more time you have, the yeah. closer you are, the more the demon will make itself known, allowing you the information to guess its name and the body it's bound to. The only way I've found to tell how far along a possession is on your own is to scribble on a piece of paper. Don't think about it. Just Welcome scribble. Aboard. Look carefully. If you notice anything... Oh my God, thank you for the sub. Welcome aboard. Thank you, thank you. There's a notepad and a pencil on the desk in the front room. Checking from time to time can give an idea of how long you might have. Okay. The night shift database. 
a computer program combining all my findings into one reference point. The database contains all the information on the process of expulsion, the tools used, and most importantly, all the markings of the known demonic names. If you ever forget what to do, replay these tapes or look it up in the database. The collection of demonic names is the most crucial piece to the puzzle. You will need this information. My ID card is in my personal belongings drawer. On the back is the passcode to access it. Use it. Wait, didn't he say that I should be able to get into the cupboard? Uh... <laughs> Pidgey, thank you for the seven months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Book of Typhon Conversions. Ugh, reading. But now I, I feel, like, feel stressed because I'm timed. I don't want to be timed. So I'm guessing what happens is the longer you take, the more it jump scares you. <laughs> Great. Oh. Yeah, screw all of whatever this is. I'm getting back to work. To banish a demon to hell, it must be bound to its chosen body and burned. The three objects in this cabinet are your tools. First, the clay tablet in the center is called a mark. Placing the smaller pieces in the correct configuration will spell the demon's name. Second, the bottles on the top shelf are a special reagent that will react <laughs> to the mark. Add a bottle to the embalming mixture during the process. When the mark is placed on the correct body with the reagent inside, it will force the demon to become bound to it. Pay attention to signs that you have chosen correctly. They can be obvious or extremely subtle. Once you are certain the demon is bound to its vessel, burn it. Finally, the pieces of paper on the right are called letting strips. It must inscribe the sigils of its name in our world to begin the evocation. You will need to uncover these sigils to use them. What? Hold a letting strip up while wandering the mortuary. If it begins to smolder and burn, you're close. When the paper combusts, the sigil has been revealed somewhere in that area. They could be anywhere. So look on walls, under objects, inside furniture. What? Anywhere. The demon will inscribe its sigils over time to try and hide them. So check regularly. Once you uncover the sigils, use the night shift database to decide which demon you're dealing with. And use that knowledge to create the mark. The steps are simple. Add the reagent to the embalming mixture. <laughs> what? Uncover the sigils. Build the mark and place it on the body. Then, when you're certain, burn it in the retort. But no, that's... That's not simple. I'm so confused. <laughs> no, he's definitely not sick. Special piece of scripture with the ability to reveal demonic markings. and a demonic markings near the, par the parchment will smolder and combust, bringing the marking into the material world to be found. So can I do shit out of order? Used to identify a demonic tendency. Ah! <laughs> At every moment, the demon is. You should have fucking died. I will slit your ashes, and your last vision as they wither will be of the flesh being peeled from your legs, and all that will be left is a. Yeah. Okay. Whatever, bitch. Uh... Uh... <laughs> oh! Yeet! But where is, where is the sigil? I do not see. This game is weird. Seems safe? Yeah, no, that seemed fine.
How do I scribble? I don't have my clip. Yeah. Oh, that is bored. Well, it, it, it smoldered. At least I can keep track of things. But I don't see where 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 the thing is. It seems complicated. No shit. I feel like I'm gonna get jump scared to death just because I have no idea what I'm doing. Um. Okay, it's a little it's a little thing like that. Don't forget chat. I think. How do I like can I inscribe this? Was this one, right? Or is it that one? I think it was this one. So is there any point fucking around with the bodies? He said I needed his ID card, right? I'm calling the police. I didn't actually want to call the police, but okay. What is this? You play? His belong- What the fuck is a belongings drawer? All of these drawers have belongings in them. Wait, that's new. Why won't you let me touch you? How's the embalming going? I haven't done any. I'm stressed. Like, surely I don't want to mess around with the bodies until I know which body I'm supposed to be. Oh. <laughs> Just stick around with the dead bodies, it'll be funny. Is there a drawer for the belongings of the peoples? <sighs> I don't know what the belongings drawer is. Employee belongings? That's a very terrifying smile. 44937. Oh, no, 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 I want it. 
Oh, can I have it? <gasps> Extra keys to the mortuary. Wait, but I'm not allowed to take them? What's this? Oh, that's my new work badge. Nice. Whatever. Just grab a body. Whatever. Forget it. Forget it. Okay, fine. I will grab a body and get started, game. There was a note in the top one? Uh, I really need to key to the hatch outside. Cleaner is low and you mentioned having some down there before. I know you don't trust anyone to go down there, but having a copy of the key would make things a lot easier for everyone. Oh boy. Watcher, thank you for the 75 months at tier 2. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Whatever. Oh wait, I need the gurney. Don't start with me. Crummy old building. Lock me in here. Scare the shit out of me. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Reginald, Jonah, Herb, Hubert, Herbert. Hey, Herbert. Stupid demon. Being a dick. His feet are... Oh look, he's got, he's got like physics, he's wiggling. Alright, let's check you out. Um, I don't remember what I do here. Uh, record any distinguishing marks. Oh yeah. I think this dude is very possessed. Ah! Help. Hello? Zumba Fitness, thank you for the 32 months. Welcome back. Hello. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Nope, nope. New job. I'm getting out of here. She says before I go straight back to examining the body. Who this? I'm getting back to work. <laughs> I got an achievement. For ignoring her. I ain't afraid of no ghost. Can I rotate your feet? No. Yeah, I'm getting out of here, but first. Mole. That everything? I think that's everything. Okay, let's go report this. Oh god, what was the thing's what was his number? <laughs> it took it I I got distracted, so I don't know what the number is anymore. Four four nine three seven. Thank you. Oh. Okay. I think that's everything. Robopon, thank you for the thirteen months. Welcome back. Uh oh, I'm missing something. Mol blemish. On the right leg, left leg. Uh, yep. Okay, I must have missed something. Why does the computer know to correct me? <laughs> I might not have checked the shoulder. No, you, you right. Oh, I checked that shoulder. Maybe I missed the shoulder. There we go. Perfect. Cool. 
cool. Let's file me some paperwork. Okay, but I have... I have a question. Like, part of... Part of figuring out... I need to file the copy up front. Part of figuring this out, right, is that I need to put the embalming fluid in the relevant body. But... What if I've already done the embalming fluid? Like, do I just embalm them again? Like, it says... Oh, I have to, like, combine the embalming fluid with the, with the, with the solution that I put into the body. Just put it in everybody, it'll be funny. Okay. It's time to embalm. Oh, she sounds real happy about it. Yeah, the reagent in the old cabinet. I haven't flew for a but only one mark. But don't I need to... Don't I need to put the mark in with the fluid? Ah, uh, I don't remember. I don't want to play the tapes because the demon is going to yell at me again. It's it said like put the embalming fluid. Why is it do why is it reset this? It said put the embalming fluid in Or like you make the mark, then you put the fluid. The game makes you put the reagent in everybody. Oh, and then I put the mark on the correct one. Oh, so I can put the creepy, the creepy fluid in every single body and then just slap the mark on the one at the end. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. Why won't you let me go to the, uh, the... There. Night shift. Ah, uh, related to the banishment of covetous demons, the history of the demonic and the tools I found through my research. Embalm each body with a special reagent. Use letting strips from the cabinet to attempt to reveal demonic sigils. Compa compare the found demonic sigils to the demon's names within the night shift database. Build the mark to match the demon's name. Pay attention to each body for demonic activity. Well, I mean, he sat up and talked. <laughs> also, it lags when I'm on this database. Note that bringing an already embalmed body back out to reinspect for changes may be necessary. Place the mark on the body believed to have demonic, demonic tendency. Burn that body in the retort before possession takes hold. Do I have to do this once? I can't imagine she's ever going to come back. But what does this do? Oh. While learning the name of the demonic entities about waiting, identifying which bodies experiencing may require playing close attention. While any of the bodies can be manipulated, it's far easier for the entity to control its own vessel. Sudden movements, large or small, can be a sign of tendency. If a body appears to be more active than the others, or strange markings start to appear, it may be signs. However, the demon is trying to best remain elusive and may manifest these manipulations on other bodies, which is why it is important to take note of which body is experiencing these events. The more events linked to a specific body, the more likely it is to be the chosen vessel. Uh... Sudden movements, repeat movements. Vessel is occupying their form. This reminds me a little bit of Welcome to the Game, and I'm not sure why. You like my eyes? Thank you. I'm sorry I'm lagging right now, but this page seems to freak out my GPU. <laughs> uh... A small as a twitch of the finger, full body manipulation. All right. This working? Yeah. Yeah. This thing is huge. So, uh, I guess, um, this is David. Hi, David. Freeman, this feels insane, but I think you were right. This has happened a few times now, but let me see if I can get in here. Why would the demon willingly do its manipulating on camera? Oh! <gasps> There it is. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. Hi, Jubin. Well, the three houses of service in the halls of Satan, the houses of sin, four sigils of bondage, below the three houses and all known covetous demons. Okay, so so far it could be Teldic. Well, that was fun. Oh, but then there's, there's like, hold on. It could also be Gulos. 
and Aizel and Masset. Okay. Uh, okay, I gotta wire the jaw shut. I have trust issues. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I can't see what I'm doing because her shadow is so huge. Moisturizer. Where's my jaw wiring tool? Oh, well, here we go. Perfect. Perfect again. I think a door is going to stop a demon. Well, at least I won't see it down the hallway. If it decides to be... I fucking hate this. There we go. Alright, inset eye caps. Give me them eye caps on. <laughs> oh, is this is this the first time some of you have seen the uh, the, uh, the 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 sewing? It's great, isn't it? It's exactly what I wanted to see. Uh, what is any of this shit? PVC tubing? Don't need that yet. Where are my eye caps? Alright, let me do some scribbling. Well, not possessed just yet. And we ain't smoldering either. It was so much easier when you just set everything out nicely on the side for me. What's this? Oh, it's more tubing. I'm getting... I can't see anything under my own shadow. <laughs> Where are my caps? It's gonna make me go near the window and I don't want to. Oh, are those eye caps? Nope. Hello? Tissue builder. Same. Bleaching agent. Caps. Why didn't the tutorial just put the things where they would be, like, in normal gameplay? Now I gotta search all this shit. Needles. That wasn't a good noise? No, that's great. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Scribbling. Is it just me or are my eyes going blurry? Where the fuck are the eye caps? Did I take them already? No, I didn't. Give me my eye caps, demon. Did you steal them? We can't hear you because your eyes are too blurry. That doesn't make any sense. Check the other rooms. I'm not leaving this room. There's a demon outside. I can't tell if I just can't find them or if the game is being real janky. Flex bag. The bottom drawer? I'm not sure I can interact with it. No, I can. Oh, there we go. I had to, I had to squat. Alright. Open those beautiful eyes for me, sir. Alright. Beautiful. Okay. Now we're doing embalming fluid. So we need... <sighs> the chemical... Oh god. It's gonna take forever to find. Methanol... I mean, can I put them in out of order? Tissue building... Cool. I can't hold anything else. Wait, what do you... what do you... what do you mean? Are you kidding me? Oh, I took the methanol by accident. Whatever. In you go, buddy. Okay. 
Why did you let me die? Cause you're a bitch. Uh, Maldehyde. Are you gonna turn back into the other guy? I hate you, door. <laughs> the demon angers. Uh, can you change back? Buddy. Wait, you're not gonna let me do the formaldehyde? It's not letting me do the formaldehyde. Are you- are you- are you making me do the thing? You're making me do the scripted event? What if I just wanna ignore your shit? Where the fuck is Harold? Sir? What if I, like... Hmm. Am I supposed to switch you back? It won't let me- it won't let me pick up the gurney, either. God damn it. Maybe... It wants me to use something on him. Okay, fine. I'll go and find out what it was you want me to see. Harold? Harold! <laughs> Where the fuck did you go? God damn it. <sighs> He's not cursed. Nope. Harold ditched me. I guess I could go look for the other at uh, the other bodies. <laughs> uh hmm. I mean it seems to want me to use an item on him. Harold dis disapproved of my embalming skills. Nope, not allowed to use that either. Hmm. I mean, he looks very skinny now. Oh, wait. His name is Reginald. Why have we been calling him Harold? <laughs> Wait, is his name Reginald? Oh god. Why have we been calling him Harold? I'm sorry, buddy. Uh... Hum. Why did we think it was Harold? Was the first person Harold? Oh no, I'm a bad I'm a bad mortuary assistant. What if what if we just cleanse him? What does this thing do? Lessen the visibility of jaundiced skin? What if I moisturize him? Do you think that's what he wants? I don't know what you want me to do, buddy. I was in the middle of embalming. Can you go away? I'm I'm busy. I don't know what you want. <laughs> I regret every second with you. Time is running out, Rebecca. Oh, he's back. Hey, buddy. Uh-oh. I'm going screwy. Alright, well, time wouldn't be running out if you hadn't pulled that bullshit. <laughs> it's it's totally not Harold. I'm calling him Harold. Fuck it. Uh, humec... humec... whatever. Uh... Nope. Nope. Oh, wait, isn't that on the shelf? Nope. Where the fuck is the thing? Is it over here? He looks like a Harold, doesn't he? I think he made a mistake not being called Harold. 
And then I need some fluid. Give me that fluid. Uh... Perfect. Okay, now we make an incision. Oh, I need to scalp him. Which all? Oh, I need, I need, uh... I'm sorry, just <laughs> let that fester for a second. It's not like it's gonna cause you any problems. You're dead. I'm missing something. Forceps? Probably forceps. Yeah. And... Clerk, 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 clerk. No! Do we only have to deal with one demon? Like, surely once I've gotten rid of the demon that possessed me... Actually, why the fuck is he looking for hired help? When he knows that shit can happen. What a dick! Fuck this guy. Fill an empty reservoir bag with cavity fluid. Alright, where's my reservoir bag? I actually saw my reservoir bags, didn't I? There was like a bunch of them. Oh, moisturizing wipe. Oh, here they are. Uh, cavity fluid. Nope. Why wouldn't you just store it next to the frick- next to the frickin- oh, here we are. Why wouldn't you store the reservoir bags next to the cavity fluid if that's the only thing that it's used for? Uh... Ew. I mean, once I find out the name, couldn't I just brand all the bodies and yeet them all? Will the demon know that I branded the wrong body and that just gives him an edge or something? There we go. Okay. Mix cleaners in the bathroom closet. I am going to get attacked to create tank cleaner. Can I apply the moisturizer first? Seems kind of weird that I have to do that afterwards. Nope, I cannot. Good. All right, put the moisturizing pad. How do I put the moisturizing I pad use, back? I can't use that here. Like, how do I put something back if I don't want it? Ah, drop. Okay, there it is. Good. That door was open. Demon or owl? Got the window in the hallway? Haha, <laughs> no! You look out the window in the hallway if you want to get spooked. I am staying over here.
No coward. Mushy, mushy, mushy. Right. Okay. Is that something at the end of the hallway? That might be... Oh, no, I think it's just a lock. Well, I have to go backwards towards it anyway, so fuck it. Am I gonna hit the door? I am. I hit the door. Oh! Good evening, sir. Wait, your turn. Did he just jiggle? I'm pretty sure Jonah just jiggled. Do not eat embalming fluid. Oh! Where could it be? Where could it be? Where is it? Where is it? Oop. Oh! L and a dot. Can you remember that chat? So we've got the seven and the L with the dot. No, I'll just I'll just put it over here. Take the L. Okay. I can hear someone talking. I'm only a little bit possessed. It's still good. It's still good. How many demons am I going to have to combat? Surely I cannot be possessed by more than one. All right, Jonah was kind of eager, so I guess I guess we'll bring Jonah out next. Hey, eager beaver. Let's hang these. Smiling. How many demons can you take at once? Well. <laughs> Double demon penetration. In a fight? Yeah, exactly. That's what we meant. Jonah Shaw. What's up, Jonah? I'm rotating you. Why oh, you gotta smile at me, buddy? You're just making it weird. Apparently, everyone that I'm examining today has, like... ...boils from the plague or something. I don't know what's going on here. Perhaps there's a demon afoot. <laughs> Let me get this one. There we go. <laughs> uh, oh. What's this one? I never read this part. Uh, so I'm going to discover a set of tools. The occupied body must contain the reagent. The mark must have the correct demonic name, and the mark must be placed on the correct body and burned. Okay. Uh, which one will be placed in the correct configuration? The mark will react to the baleful agent inside, binding the demon to it once the demon is bound, burn the body. Once you're in this correct portage of this name into our world, they're hidden from us till revealed by the burning of letting parchment. I'm assuming the burning of letting parchment will only progress as I do stuff. Otherwise I could just run around getting all the letting parchment and ignore half the bodies. But I don't think it would let me do that.
Uh, it just came out. Before, I think it was only a demo. Don't do that shit again. <laughs> Holding in my paper. Surely it couldn't attack me here. Jeebus is right there. Okie dokie, off we go again. What happens if I run out of materials? I already have one of those. Ah. <laughs> I already have one of those. Ah. Okay. Hey! Who's beautiful? It's you. Insert the eye caps. Do I already have the eye caps? I do not have more eye ca caps. Mm, boop. No, no. Boop. 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 All right. Boop. Cool. Perfect. Is that the guy that got replaced? No, no. It was a totally different dude. Uh, mix the embalming fluid again. And I now know that I can just shove that all in there. Oh no, come on. I am working! What's this one again? Fuck, what am I using? Glue tar- that, that's part one of them, right? Yeah. What if I just like... I wonder if the best way to play this game is to not buy into its bullshit and every time it does something spooky I just ignore it. Just speed run it. It's fine. Uh, where was the human? Whatever. This way? Yeah. Did I miss FXCL sub? I might have done. Thank you for the 31 months. I don't remember calling it out. If I did, then I'm dumb. If I didn't, I'm so sorry for missing it. And thank you. Okay. Uh, and then the reagent. Yoink. Okay, so in terms of like... In terms of creepy shit, the only one that's really done anything was Reginald, right? Also known as Harold. <laughs> uh, what am I doing here? I need the, 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 the... I need... Oh shit! Spooky possession's happening again. Uh oh. It's okay, just ignore it. Mind over matter, dude. Mind over matter. Periodically check for marks. I'm not dragging them in and out. I'm missing something. Scalpel. Whoop. Mm -hmm. You're in Iceland? Are you having a nice time? Sport. Actually, yeah, the shop of the country. Do not sip the- what are you doing? Do not sip. Do not. What the frick, guys? Uh, fill an empty bag with the cavity fluid. Cavity fluid. <laughs> It said not to trust the phones. I'm ignoring you. He said he wouldn't call again. 
Nothing good will come of that. Fuck off. I'm working. What if it's important? It's not gonna be important. What's going on with this guy's belly button? Is his belly button demonic? It's not gonna stop, is it? Ring, 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 ring. Banana phone. Beep, 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 beep. There we go. Da -da 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 I've got this feeling so appealing for us to get together and sing, sing. Ring, 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 ring. Banana phone. Boop, 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 boop. Ding, dong, ding, dong, ding, dong, ding. Banana phone. It grows in bunches. I've got my hunches. It's the best. Beats the rest. Cellular, modular, interactive, modular. <laughs> <laughs> my punishment for not answering the phone! I need to report a missing person. She. She has a drug problem. She didn't answer the phone. I am demons now. Sorry. Rebecca. What's up? Rebecca. Rebecca. Hey. Rebecca, no. <laughs> what are you doing with your hands? God, God, oh my God. Fuck. Okay, baby, don't worry. It's okay. It's okay, too. I'll, I'll get you out of here. Who are you? Please, sir. I'm just right, right up there. I, I, I'm coming back. I'm coming right back. I'm busy. There's gonna be a demon hey! pops out of there. Hey, I found her! Down here! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, that's terrible. That loud that sound effect is loud as shit. Oh hey. I'm back. Yeah. Ring, 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 ring. Banana phone. Beep, 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 beep. Banana phone. Oh. Da 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 <laughs> Alright. That looks like, I don't know, hangman's noose or some shit. Alright, whatever. We got it. Oh, I cover it up? That's awesome. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see. This one. Okay, in terms of like possible configurations, there can't be that many that use all those symbols. So let's go have a quick look. Let's see. Uh, that one... That one... None of them have all three, right? <laughs> what was the last one? Uh, it just released. That one, that one. Oh, that could be right. Hazel. L, that one. Okay, so if there's no more, I just need to figure out which body's possessed, right? Sorry, I lag when I'm on this webpage for some reason. L, C. 
circle. Okay, no, that's it. That's it. Like, right? Because none of the others could possibly have the right combination. Because F Fermok has, has a wrong rune. So it has to be Azel. Sparrow, thank you for the 37 months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Okay, so... That goes to the left. L on the right. Hangman on the bottom. How do I... How do I remove this? Oh no, was I not supposed to set that up in real time? Uh oh. I, I can't move them. <laughs> oh wait, maybe I can just change it? Uh, what was the last piece? Uh, that weird H. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so this is the mark, right? I can't hold anything else. Oh, bitch. Okay, so that's gonna have to sit there until we figure it out. Okay, so now all I need to do is figure out which one of you is a dick. But some weird stuff happened with the first guy, like it swapped the body and shit. So. Uh, tank cleaner. Why are we summoning demons? No, we're trying- we're trying to stop a possession. Oh, the opposite, actually. The door reopened? Yeah, it did. Ha <laughs> fuck you. Yeah. Alright. You doing some weird source shit in there? I think I have some signs switched? L on the right. Weird, not hiragana symbol on the left. No, that looks right. What the fuck is making that noise? Okay. Is that new? That looks new. Oh wait, no, that's the scar that I made. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. It is new. And it's my fault. Yeah, these corpses are really attention seeking. What the heck? I absolutely expect to get jump scared at least once when I'm moving this body around. It seems kind of funky that this guy would ever risk bringing on al along any kind of assistant. You know? Seems like a good way to get someone killed. Have there been jump scares? Yeah, it's weird though. I feel like what's jump scared me hasn't actually really been the stuff that the game wanted to jump scare me. Like, it's had corpses sit up and pull into view and stuff, and those haven't been the scary things. <laughs> hey. Are you ready? Are you ready for love? Yes, I am. But yeah, the shop page showed multiple scary things, so I'm assuming there are multiple demons. So some bullshit is gonna occur. <laughs> I 
Wait, is this the body that like popped up halfway through? I don't think it is. Uh, step one, look at Marks. His name is Herbert Whitney. Did I somehow combine Harold and, and Herbert? Or Reginald and Herbert even? I can't tell if everyone here has, like, something weird going on with their skin, or if the person that made it is just, like, portraying acne in a very unflattering way. Orbital Tuna, thank you for the 28 months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. There we go. I'm a model. I mean, and I do my little dance on the catwalk. On the catwalk. Oh, I'm being weird again. Yeah, this guy's doing pretty good. I'm not okay. <laughs> Hi, Bash. How many times do you think the game's put something scary out the window and I've just absolutely denied it? Why do we still work here? He locked the door. I'm missing something. Oh, so now I don't have the pieces. Fine. I think this is my least favorite part. This is gross. There we go. Rebecca, come down here. <laughs> Fuck off. Rebecca. No. <laughs> you can't just you can't just here, No. In what fucking world would I ever do that? Rebecca, come down here. No! No! I refuse! Here, I don't want to be the stupid horror movie protagonist. But you're going to make me. That's Rebecca, dumb. Oh no, player. You have fallen right Rebecca. into my trap. Also, it's disabled the pause function. That's, that's, that's dickish. Rebecca. 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 <sighs> Stubu, it's time for your spooking. Fine. Rebecca, come down here. <laughs> Why in the fuck would you ever go down there? It's time to be scared. I want to turn the volume down because I'm going to get screamed at. Weird. I never noticed this odd little basement part before. Down we go. Oh no. How could this have happened? So, little Raymond thinks he found a replacement. Huh. Another sacrifice to save his fucking skin! <gasps> oh, look, it's the creepy peoples. Huh. 
Hey guys. up creepy mannequins nine I don't know what that means you get the feeling our boss is doing some shady shit yeah or is it a nine or a Q Welcome aboard. Thank you, thank you. Oh, hey. That way? Okay, I'll go. Into the grave. <laughs> Lost in Buga, thank you for the thousand bits. Thank you very, very much. Fuck you, Raymond. I rise! No, I don't rise. Perhaps I shouldn't have done exactly what the demon told me. Strange how that happens. Uh, it's not looking good for me. Can I, can I climb back in the window? No? Okay. I'll go around. What's the deal with the scribbles? The more possessed I am, the more freaky the scribbles get. <laughs> thank you again for the thousand bits, Lost in Boca, and thank you for the hundred bits, Rockerlin. Thank you, thank you. I mean, unfortunately, I don't think leaving will actually turn off the whole demonic possession thing. I think that's just a thing now. <laughs> What's this about? Demonic possession! Uh, what am I doing? Oh god, I only started the eye caps? Jesus, we're gonna be here forever. All right. <laughs> I like how calm she still sounds during this part. Embalming fluid in pump. Yeah. Someone poured contact lens testing solution into my eyes, but that's fine. I didn't need to be able to see in proper color. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Okay, 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 okay. I feel like self-preservation is the only way I can... Like, sorry, the only way that I can do this and not feel, go completely insane is to just, like, not let myself get sucked in by the atmosphere, if that makes sense. If I shout at the demon and call him a bitch, then he is a bitch. Oh, hey. I'm just... I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna do this. Do you mind? Okay, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Wishka, thank you for the 32 months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. It was in the window, yeah. <laughs> Did 
The way it zooped out of there was kind of funny. Okay, so let's do a quick tally. Which body has been the most sus so far? It has, it has to be Harold, also known as Reginald, right? He sat up, he swapped bodies. I haven't seen, have you seen any jiggling? I don't think I've seen any jiggling. Like, I haven't seen anybody do some, some wiggling and wobbling. I'd like to check Harold's body again, but I don't seem to be able to remove a body mid, mid, uh, embalming. Like, I can't just, like, grab this body and take it out now and swap it out with Harold's. Maybe I should have took, taken a look at him between the embalmings. I'm missing something. Me too. Harold is his demon name. <laughs> yeah, I kind of resent that the game is just like, hey, it's time for your spooking. It's just like, okay, video game. Oops. God damn it. Oh no. Go that way, streamer. I don't want to. <laughs> can I not, can I not just play the game? I mean, two creepy things have happened during this guy's stuff, but it might just be because I'm more possessed at this point. All right, off we go. This whole is much longer than I remember. Something's gonna run at me, isn't it? Yeah. Hey. Okay. Okay. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Hey. <laughs> I don't like that guy. He's weird. Okay. I'm gonna go back to embalming now. Loud noises equals scary. To be honest, although I am playing at a reasonably low volume, it hasn't really done the loud noises equals scary that much. I kind of resent that it's like making me do rookie rookie possession mistakes though. Oh, fuck me. It's not looking good. Yeah, I, I do resent that it's like forcing me to fuck up. I'll just, I guess I'll just wait for the, for, for the Uzi to run out. Honestly, all this reminds me of is when my contact lenses get dry. It's like, <laughs> I need some eye drops. Although, maybe it won't. Maybe it won't. Oh, wait, no, we're back to normal. Okay. Uh... Okay, time for some more tank cleaner. Am I about to get deaded? Potentially. I don't think I close that. Uh, yeah, this game originally had a demo. I remember watching someone play a little bit of the demo, I think. <laughs> da 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 da
How am I supposed to examine you now? Stop. Ah! <laughs> God damn it. Ah. Did I just go straight into a second possession event? Fucking Harold, dude. You son of a bitch. Actually, can I do a last minute look up over him? No? Alright, might be that way. I don't think I'm doing too hot, though, in terms of the old possession scale. Oh, there's someone peering at me. If you could not, I would appreciate that. Thank you. He's still looking at me. He's still looking. Oh no, it's kind of weird when the demons are like so attention hungry that they just like sit there staring, waiting for you to notice them. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> Alright, I'm getting Harold. Harold is like hyper sus. I don't know why he's Harold. He just is. Alright, come here, Harold. What happens if I get the wrong body, though? Do I just, like, burn all of them? <laughs> this guy moved even more- That is true! But didn't it say that the demon would misdirect? Alright, Harold. You feeling particularly demonic today? Not really. The door's doing some suspect things again. Stop it. I mean, no, he, he looks okay. I don't think those markings are new. Hmm. I heard that. I mean, it could still be him. It's hard to tell. Alright, who did the most bullshit? I think it was the final body, but that also might have something to do with the fact that I, uh... I was the most possessed when looking at the final body. Um. Is one body more active than the others? Well, I would say that the first guy, sorry, last guy was, but sudden movements, repeat movements. New markings. I mean, but that's those scratches look way different. The the scratches on the on the bodies like so far look kind of just like yep, oopsie doopsie got bo hit by your cat. This is slightly different. <laughs> oh God, no! Don't do this to me again. I'm busy. Oh. Hey. Oh, I don't like that part. <laughs> Streamer, it's time for your daily spooking. <laughs> I 
Are you gonna make me run over there? I think she might. Sometimes I feel like in horror games, the best thing to do is just run straight towards the spook. Oh, we're back. Okay, I can examine him again, so I guess that event's done. Just a little bit more looking, just to make sure. Yeah, we're looking at Harold again. Oh! <gasps> That's new, isn't it? No, 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 no. No, okay, that, that was always there, I think. <laughs> that guy desperately wants us to acknowledge his name is Reginald. I'm not doing it. Damn it, Harold. Oh yeah, can I check my report on the markings? How do I do that? Ugh. Hmm. Okay, so what did the second guy do? The second guy didn't really do a whole lot. I mean, the first guy did- had the most demon- Sorry, the third guy had the most demon events, but I think that was just because I'm really, really possessed. Hi, Toast! Yeah, this is- this is a cozy stream, you can tell from the tag. The second didn't really do anything, did he? It was the bathroom thingy with the second one? I don't know if that's related to the body, though, or the amount of time that passed. The second one talked. Yeah, he did. Let's check in for marks. Problem is, I'm not observant enough to tell if the body's moving. <laughs> I have- I have embalmed all the bodies, at least. No new marks. Like, do I have time to just sit and stare at the body, wait for them to move? Yeah, I think the feet moving when the gurney is- is active is just like... He has scratches. Like, none of them have marks. Do I just sit here and watch them for a while? Just be like, ha ha! You moved! Second guy was an eager beaver, wasn't he? I don't think I have time to just sit and watch them, though. Does that say your soul? <laughs> you are a soul. <laughs> Yeah, what if I missed... What if I missed a body movement just because I had the camera pointed in the wrong direction? That would suck. Okay, so... Wait, let's list, let's list what happened so far. First body... Body swapped halfway through the examination and disappeared for a while. Also ran down the corridor at us. Um... Second body was an eager beaver, popped out of the thing super quickly. Uh, otherwise didn't do much. Then the third body contorted, and... Wait, did the se was the second body the one that talked? Adam Lobo, thank you for the 40 months, welcome back. Thank you, thank you. 
Didn't it also say that the demon would try and misdirect you? So does any of this fucking matter? Oh, why can't I examine you? Come on, don't be like this. D don't start. Fuck. Why can't I examine you? That's super sus, buddy. He 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 won't he won't go into the thing. Uh... Uh... I think I bugged it. <laughs> oh, hey! Oh, bye! Uh, that might be why. <laughs> Seriously, I cannot put him back on the thing. Go back in. Yeah, but if I can't examine this guy, I'm just gonna fucking burn him. Thank you! Alrighty then. Still can't examine him. How suspicious! I should be able to examine him, though, right? Yeah. Hey, Stinky, why can't I examine you? Um. Did I break the jump scare event? Spoops borped. Uh, mild abrasion. I thought I resolved everything. Oh, it's doing that bullshit again. <sighs> Stop it! Harold, stop! Thank you. Look in Harold. I think if I wanted to see marks on him, I would have to turn him over. Paper? I I don't really need the new the name anymore. I think I'm gonna lose this game just because it won't let me exam oh won't let me examine this fucker. Oh boy. Maybe do I actually am I not allowed to skip? And I have to actually find the thing. Wow, could it be that shape that I knew? Wow, amazing. Yeah. 
Yeah, maybe I needed the paper. Okay, let's do another examining again. Hello again, Harold. I am super possessed right now. Stop it! Attention seeking cadavers? Wee 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 wee. It's my turn to spook this Jimmy. It's getting worse. <laughs> um, is the mark on his wrist new? Which one? That? I don't think so. I'll double check for you. <sighs> right arm. No, he had it on both. Um, I don't know who it is because I'm not catching the body movement. Hmm. Hmm. You want to look at the third one? Maybe it'll let me know, yeah. We have a spooky game here. Kind of. I did feel like I saw the hands move on one of the corpses when I was bringing it into the thing. And I haven't seen, like, hand movement doesn't seem to be a thing. It just seems to be that their feet wiggle, you know? Hey. I did take the mark. I have it. It's in my pockets. Unless you mean, like, put it on someone, in which case I haven't tried that. Do you see that? He's wiggling. The others don't do that as much. Like, his, his whole body wiggled a little bit. I still can't examine him. I'm starting to get annoyed. I don't know if it's bugged or what. I, th I think it's bugged. Like... I, f I don't feel like the demon won't let you examine a particular body is actually a part of the thing. <laughs> Want me to squat? I'm squatting. Did the game break? I think so. He seems low, maybe? Hold on, can I... I'll exit and come back, see if it helps. But I feel like the fact that I moved him all the way out and took him all the way back would mean that it would resolve any bugs. Because I could sw I could I could do others in the meantime. Body's embalmed too. Wait, wait, one of the body. It's not fucking embalmed? What do you mean? Ah, shit. I think it bugged. Oh, is it because it interrupted my moisturizing? Hey, it reset my freaking. We're 
Return body to cold storage. No, it says he's moisturized. Did he just never get registered as done? The second isn't fully embalmed? Are you sure? This is the third guy. This is the guy that we couldn't examine anymore. I don't think I got some sanity back. That's just as bad as it- Oh wait, no, no, no! It's an autosave, so yeah. The forehead sores are new. No, they're not. Not on this body, I don't think so. I am less possessed. That's cool, but that does mean I'm gonna get a repeat event, which kind of sucks. Herbert Wang. I believe... Not Wang. Herbert Whitney. Why did I call him Wang? Uh... Yeah, he always had that. Mild abrasion on the right arm. Yeah, that's correct. Mr. Wang. Glancing at the Wang. My bad. Wait, what? Oh, why, why is it smoking? But I can't touch this. Oh god, have I bugged the game? He has a new mark. He has a new mark. Okay, so we've got... I think that's new. No, no, that was always there. I don't know why that's doing that, then. <laughs> oh, hello. Can I help you? Oh, he's a lot jiggling. Huh. Is that the second body? That's number two, right? That's not- that's not the first one. Heavy breathing. <laughs> Excuse me? He turned into a dog. Okay then. It's still dark down there. I don't like that. <laughs> um. I called him a bitch? No, I didn't. Oh, wait, does that mean that I don't officially have the third symbol yet? Okay, those are in the right places. Okay, I guess I gotta run over there and turn the light back on. I can't see shit, though. What am I supposed to- I can't see shit in there. Weird. Am I sure I want to turn it back on? Not really. <laughs> oh, wasn't there a whole thing with the... Like, fuses or something? Well, I don't know if that did anything. But if I can't- if I can't see anything, how am I supposed to deal with that? <laughs> I'm wondering if it's bugged again. Hold on. Like, I'm wondering if the lights were supposed to turn back on and they never did. Walk into it? The light switch is white and stands out. Oh, okay. Okay, so it's actually supposed to happen. You're supposed to just go into the creepy. Got it. My eyes shine, they do! It's night vision. To help me deal with the spooks.
So wait, 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 wait. Are the shifts just like re procedurally generated and the game can just go on forever? Because it's counting like demons banished zero means I can banish more than one demon. Based on real events, absolutely. I mean, surely the best thing to do would just be to like finish this one, banish the demon, get out of dodge, and never come back, right? Hi, Jonah. my paycheck? <laughs> Why would you give a flying heck about your paycheck at this point? I think the point is... Oh, hey. Okay, bye. <laughs> I, th I think the point is... <laughs> you can't just leave because the possession will follow you. <laughs> <laughs> I think it might be body number two. He's the only one that wiggles when I bring him down that corridor. And he was the one that just showed up there, right? I hate it when it does that. Body number three that wiggles? Is it? I fucking hope not. Number three is the one that's smoking? We don't judge for that. But Harold showed up when body number three was out, but that might be related to body number three rather than Harold himself. Hum. Hum. Sometimes you wiggle, does that mean you're possessed? Unfortunately, yes. Check out that suspicious bulge, dude. All right, do we just sit here, hang out with the body until something weird happens? Stare at his feet. Look at his feet. Stare at his hands. I don't think having long fingers is a sign of demonic possession. Dude, I just want out at this point. <laughs> I don't know which body it is. I haven't seen any new markings pop up. His chest is occasionally wiggling, but I can't tell if that's actually important. I don't think it is. Does he have not does he not have the mark on his neck anymore? He does not. A demonic healing. They're known for that, right? Oh, wrong body. We're trying to find out the name of the demon so that we can bind it to the body that it is inhabiting and banish it before it possesses us. The mark hasn't spawned yet. It's written on my whiteboard in the bed. Nice. <clears throat> There's a 
time limit. There's like a possession meter in my in my here. And as I get more possessed, it updates. Oh yeah? Tell me more, buddy. You wanna? Okay. <laughs> Just slam the gurney into the possessed person. It'll be fine. Like, I don't see any new marks on anyone. <sighs> Just have a small moment where we wait for him to wiggle his toes. Wiggle your big toe! <clears throat> Wiggle your big toe. Wiggle your big toe. No, it's not doing it. <laughs> How possessed are you feeling today, sir? I mean, I think... I think... The marks would be more obvious... If they were demonic marks, because they tend to have, like, specific... Things that count as demonic marks. So, Reginald, also known as Harold, for some reason. Uh, contusion, left shoulder mole, left arm... Yep. That all looks good to me. He looks fine. Maybe the new marks would appear until after I have, like, found all of the things. Like, am I allowed to sequence break there, or is it always set? Like, do I have to find all of the, the marks before I can guess? Or can I be like, haha, I have sussed you out. Just with two? Hmm. Yeah, I feel like only one body has his hands wriggle when I come through here, but that might just be like, you know, a quirk of how they were animated. Well, I need all four, but I figured out all four based on process of elimination. Not the fodder. Thank you for the 13 months. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. So it's like, can I skip a step by being like, yeah, I figured out all four because only one demon has three, these three, so it has to be that one. I am using the paper, but the paper's not going off. It is really difficult with these games to know if this is intentional or a bug. <laughs> like, was that intentional? <laughs> was that a demonic possession or was that a bug? <laughs> Is that Harold over there? Do you see that? I think Harold is like peeping down from the ceiling. Hey. Okay, the physics have gone fucked. Oh, um, it might be the dried up dude. You might be right there. Oh, he's gone.
Oh, at least I can re-examine this guy now. So that was a bug. Okay, so this guy has always had marks on his head. Is this a fun game? It was until I got stuck. Now I'm confused. Creepy things happen more with the third guy. But is that just because, like, I got more possessed when I was examining him? Wasn't he smiling? I think it's a trick of the light. It's it's the, the light reflecting on his lips. Yeah, all the bodies are embalmed. It was a mere trick of the light, yes. <laughs> what if we start just guessing? I'm, I'm not sure if that would accomplish anything. <laughs> I do not know at this point. Lethargically, thank you for the 28 months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Softlock bugs? Maybe? I can't tell if I'm soft locked or not. I mean, we did originally find the fourth one, but now it's now I can't get it again. We might have to come back to this because I think there are quite a few bugs. You want to try restarting the game? Okay. Is he embalmed? They are. The problem is when I reload my save, it resets me back to right before I embalmed the, the third one. So it always says that I've done two. Okay, let's try again. Launch. Maybe do a clean save? I'm not doing the, save, the game all over again. <laughs> no! <laughs> Zero element, thank you for the 16 months. Welcome back. Just speed run the whole thing, yeah. Just burn him, what's the worst that could happen? I mean, I could lose the mark and then be stuck and die. <laughs> what bugs did Bach get? But yeah, it says two because it the last time it saved was when right before I embalmed the third one, if that makes sense. I guess I'll just burn a body. Hello again. Uh what? Uh oh. This doesn't seem to be working anymore. Okay, no, there we go. Pick number three, my lord. Hey, Blue Spike. 
if you like pina coladas and getting caught in the rain. Oh, exactly. Thank you for the 27 months. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, business cards. Woo. One left. Wait, did I just take that? Huh. What's the matchbox for? Welcome up <gasps> Blue Spike! Thank you for gifting 10 subs to the community. Thank you very, very much. That is incredibly kind of you. Yeah, I'm no longer getting that third sigil now. Or fourth sigil. So, uh... That's... that's not good. Alright. Who shall I burn? Well, that's not a good noise. <laughs> you guys hate Harold? <laughs> If you burn yourself, you can't get possessed. Easy. <clears throat> I mean, Harold's gotten used a lot, but... Like, he swapped with... No, the body that he swapped with wasn't actually any of the other bodies. He swapped a what body? I think it was some kind of body from our past because it was like... We've had like an event as well and he's like, Why did you let me die? <sighs> I don't know, chat. Burn the next body that moves and... This is the only body whose hands move when I'm moving the gurney. But I don't know if that means anything or if it's just kind of funky. Oh, come on, dude. Let me go. Okay. <laughs> Thanks! His pecs move too? <laughs> I'm not sure if exuberant pec movement is a bug. Or, or a, a demonic possession sign. You got a thing. There are only three bodies. Like, as far as I can tell, the only thing that all these bodies are guilty of is having some zits. That door's open again. Okay. The scratch is new? Check his <laughs> penis. I'm not allowed to check his penis. <laughs> right arm. Mild abrasion. No, sorry. Left arm. Mild abrasion. No, that's not new. Do his feet smell? <laughs> Why are you guys gonna make it so weird? Wait, left shoulder, right shoulder. Left shoulder didn't originally have anything. Oh! <gasps> Now there are two marks! Huh? <gasps> look, <gasps> look, 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 look! His left shoulder... Wait, no, right shoulder has blemishes and a mole? What? There's no way that's a both of the shoulders. No, that's not... Okay, that's not new then. That's... That is absolutely... His left shoulder. <laughs> 
Rakuta, thank you for the six months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. That's that's left, that's right, but they're both listed as right. Did the door do something? I wasn't paying attention. I missed a resub? Oh, Fred! Thank you for the 94 months! Welcome back! Thank you, thank you! <laughs> and Captain Dumplin, thank you for the four years. Thank you very, very much. Yeah, it says Blemish's Mole on the right shoulder. You think that you think that the, the, the mole moved from right to left? The demon moved his mole? Disgusting behavior, really. <laughs> do you do you think the second the second person has a demonic mole? Just burn the fucker? Okay. How do I burn him? Not be dropped, but maybe return to the wardrobe. Oh. We demons now. Oh, it's this shit again. <sighs> Whose body is that? Number one? Oh no, he's here. <laughs> That's number three again? Okay. Alright, now back to normal. Oh crap. <laughs> Was that number three? It didn't really look like number three. He was bald? Yeah. Did I close the door through my body? Absolutely. So it's neither, it's none of those actual bodies. Or it could be this guy. Okay, how do I drop the mark on him then? There we go. Are you sure this is the right one? No. <laughs> Peace. Hmm. I think I might be dead. Ow. Yeah, it's fully released. Did I get it right? <gasps> I am winner! Also, I just realized that the uh, the ambient lighting isn't working anymore because I relaunched the game. <laughs> Good morning. It's nice not to be the one down there for a change. Uh, Raymond? I win. Uh, I suppose a first name basis is in order. D did I make it? Is it over? Yay! No. It's never really over. You've come a long way. It's a lot to learn. I'm so glad I'm here. I know it's disorienting. You'll get used to it. You should head home and get some rest. Every night can be different. Oh, good. I think I'm fine. Are you sure? You seem out of it. Uh oh. Oh, I've just been <gasps> waiting. Actually possessed! So, so long. What? What are you. 
<laughs> you chose the wrong body. Rebecca. Rebecca's not here, you fucking idiot! Oh no! A twist! Watch your foolish boy. And drink it as it melts from your pit of a friend. Delicious. I refuse to take the blame. <laughs> oh, rip. <laughs> I cannot believe that in the end, the bonite has got him. No, I think that's the I fucked up and got the wrong body ending, but it's kind of hard to tell which body it was because I'm not sure the game was actually like progressing. Because I wasn't getting the sigils or anything. <laughs> Yeah, it's like, was was that meant to happen or was that a bug? <laughs> maybe, maybe I made the game mad by putting the marks in before I had finished all of them. So wait. If if I if I burn the wrong body, why did it do the whole thing about the demon crawling out and then getting banished? Was that just the demon fucking with me? Or was that like the the cutscenes ended up being implemented incorrectly? <laughs> mm -hmm. I have been possessed once. Ending three of five. Da da da. What can the other endings be? Maybe one of them is just that I don't burn any of the bodies and just wait to get murdered. Yeah, like one of the endings is probably you took too long. One of the endings is probably you left and then got possessed. One of the endings is probably you burn the other body or the correct body. Well, no, I, I did, Erwin. It just kind of got funky about it, I think, because I restarted at some point. Like, the checklist just said, put the body back in cold storage, and then I did. And I think maybe it fucked up because it, like, it did think that I had embalmed it, but then again, I also didn't. Okay, hold on a second. Let me fix the thing. Uh, fixing, fixing, fixing. There. Fixed. Wait, how can I have another shift? How can I have another shift? Raymond's dead! <laughs> It doesn't make any sense. Reset the frickin' sensitivity every time. Okay, it's no longer... Oh, there we go. I have to hit the close button, of course. Uh... I don't know. Is it because I refuse to- I refuse to let, uh... Look out of windows and stuff? That's fine, Masamune. But... The game bugged. Telephone. So can I speedrun this shit this time? 
So why can I take matches? The mythic box. One left. At least I can keep track of things. Hmm? Okay, hangman symbol. How do you think I bugged it? What should I do to avoid it next time? Oh. Oh, now we've got Justin, Molina, Randall Armstrong, and... MJ Pag... Pag... Pagila? To avoid bugs, just be perfect. Okay, I'll try that next time. You miss Harold? <laughs> Me too. Who do you think was the, the baddie in that one? Do you think it was Harold? Three was also a sus. I'm not doing it. Their eyes are always open at the start. There we go. Alright, VGS, VGS, VGS. Oh. Oh, okay. I have to actually. No, their eyes close when I sew them shut. Seven seven four double six three. So I wonder if they stopped exhibiting like Thing, or the mark stopped or wouldn't move around because of the whole fact that the game was bugged out. It just, it just, it feels like I should have seen more signs of demonic possession, but all that was happening was just the game was doing scare events and just got stuck. <laughs> Hi, Cosmic. Welcome, welcome. Am I killing innocents? No. I'm embalming bodies. Yeah, the game got stuck and thought that I only embalmed two bodies. There we go. Uh... You know what? This time I'm gonna answer it. Hello? Right. <laughs> uh... Yeah, well, it was definitely that the body was wrong. I don't think the name was wrong because uh, it couldn't have been any other demon. But I think it stopped giving me body or wouldn't give me body signs like markings moving around and stuff because. Uh, the game didn't think that I had finished looking at the bodies, so they were always staying the same, maybe? You like my speed? 
Also, is the speed at which you become possessed, like, static, or does it just progress as you, uh, complete tasks? Like, is there any point moving quickly? I'm missing something. How oh, does the tape recorder help the process? It tells you uh, what you're doing. You like my avatar? Thank you. What is that machine? Uh, it drains the bodies. Um, sucks to be you, I guess. I think that... Is that me? It might be me. Do you think the demon gets frustrated if I don't, don't pay attention to it? I can't shut the doors, they're stuck open. Oh, I can't interact with that either, so I guess I'm just gonna wait here. <laughs> Fine, I'm gonna go touch it. I'ma touch it. Oh, no! Oh, you want something? I don't know what to give you, buddy. Um, what could it want? Do you want a scalpel? No one tell me what she wants. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh. Pop the thingy in there. Switch it all around real good. I mean, there's been like two, two, two moments where I've been legitimately creeped out, and then the rest has just been kind of like, oh, something happened abruptly. I think the only time that I was kind of uncomfortable is when one of those mannequins turned and it was like, demon face! <laughs> there we go. Oh, maybe she did want the cross. Maybe if I had given her a cross, she would have stopped being possessed. <laughs> just, just stop being possessed, forehead. It's that easy. Oh. Where could it be? Oh, not, not there. Jeebus? Yeah. But where? But where? It's not Jeebus. Do you guys see it? It's kind of like a little bit funky about where things are. I can't see shit. <laughs> My hair was on fire? I don't think that's... that was it. Did the door reopen by itself? Probably. Scared to go near the door? A little bit. Nope. Hmm. Hmm. 
Not out here. I can't use that here. What can I use it for? Ceiling? No. I have no idea where that went. <gasps> there it is. Weird... M. Lopsided M. <laughs> Good. Great. H. Yeah, okay. Sideways 3. Fantastic. Look like a 3. We'll go with 3 then. Oh wait, I was supposed to be doing can cleaner. My bad. Forgot. Oh, that was absolutely not my shadow. <laughs> Excuse me, coming through. I don't know why I have to wait for that to finish cleaning to moisturize the patient. Surely I should just be able to do that. Sweep, 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 sweep. All right. Made you look pretty for your death. Was this always closed? I don't think it was. Alright, one body down. Which one did you live in? It was this one, right? Whee. No, no, go in. There you go. Good job. Is that absolutely Harold's body? Oh, that is absolutely Harold's body. He's back! He's pretending to be Justin Molina, but it's Harold. He's back! I'm so glad! I thought we were gonna be apart forever. Silly Harold masquerading under other legal names. Classic Harold move, bro. He's even got the same foot blemishes. He's smiling because he missed me. Apparently I missed something because I haven't gotten the go-ahead. What? Oh yeah? There we go. Oh, there we are. Ding dong. <laughs> I cannot believe Harold lied about his age. And his name. <laughs> And all of his personal details. Okay, I feel like the possession is moving way faster, which makes me think it's actually related to... Like, the... Oh... Stop that. It's actually related to how much progress you've made, rather than how much time you're spending. Because I am going, like, two times faster than I was last time. And it's like, no, you're absolutely more possessed. <laughs> the 
This game feels calm. There we go. Are you secretly a demon? Oh, yeah? Well, I don't like that. Well, that's, that's tomorrow's problem. All right. <laughs> Future limes can deal with that bullshit. <laughs> All right, embalming fluid. It's weird. There's actually... There's some things I haven't figured out. This bleaching agent is here. As well as... This tissue builder? Restoring emancipated tissue. I haven't found a use for those yet. How's Wesker doing? He's good. Small. Rebecca, come here. <sighs> really? But I don't want to go there. I don't want to go there. It's some bullshit. Rebecca, come here. Come here now. <sighs> Fine. I'm going. Oh, is that supposed to be my mother? Mother, no! Stupid bitch. <laughs> Hate me all you want. <clears throat> He's dead because of you. <gasps> you should be the one here. No! Like Not the Boonitis! Ah! <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, what were we doing? Uh, methanol. Oh, I found a thing. A th a weird that 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 literally looks like some kind of hiragana character. Uh. Okay, so there's the three. Should I avoid putting them in here, or can I actually do that? I'm worried about, like, breaking it. <laughs> yeah, that character. So it was this one, right? This one, and this one, and the funky M. Is there anywhere to put the symbols? There is. I was just tossing them in there and I can fix it later. Okay, that could actually be what's breaking it though, so... <laughs> Oopsie poopsie. Let me go look at the database. Um, I think that's it again, isn't it? Kovos. Kovu! <laughs> Invoke his name! Alright, uh... 
Wait, which one was where? Shit, how do I fix... How do I switch them all around again? What am I swapping? I'm swapping the three... Wait, the three was in the right position? No. I saw that, Harold. What are you doing? Harold, that's very suspicious. Yeah, this needs to go on the bottom, but I don't seem to be able to swap them. I guess I could do this. And then put that there. Okay, but the others are right. What was the last one? The L. No. Leon will jump scare me and I don't want to be jump scared. <laughs> Splurp! But yeah, I think that- I think that can be a mark into Harold B and Hella Sus. Wait, were there more cuts on him? Oh yeah! Oh yeah, that's pretty demonic. Wouldn't you say? Just a little demonic. someone standing at the window. <laughs> I'm gonna pretend I didn't see it. I think the point is that the, the demon will misdirect, didn't it say? It, like, the demon will sometimes, see, like, like, uh, mark the wrong body. And it's about the frequency of the occurrences. There we go. Hey! Can I help you? Why are you being so weird about this? I can't check the rest of him for marks until I finish the embalming. As far as I'm aware. She's still there. You're making this very weird. Could you not? Okay, thanks. Bye. I, th I think that it's really funny thinking about demons as just being like little pranksters. Like whenever I watch, uh, what is it, paranormal activity type movies, they're like, it is a terrible fearsome demon that will possess you, but first it will rattle your pans. <laughs> Sometimes it might close your doors. Ooh. All right. Oh, not this attention-seeking bullshit. Stop it. Okay, so we're marking Harold down as super sus, right? Also... Let me get hardware info up, because I feel like I can smell my computer. <laughs> and someone did say that this game can melt graphics cards. Eh, it's fine. It's fine. Leon thinks he's so sneaky. Hello, my darling. Hello. You're trying to spook? You are not good at spook because you are a puppy. Hey. Hey. Down. Down. 
the boy. <laughs> okay, let's see. It's really warm. <laughs> okay. Is it always the same demon? Like, not as in necessarily the name, but the appearance of the demon? Is it always Mr. Mr. No Mouth? And if it's always Mr. No Mouth, why does the lady show up? Is she just helping out? Your demon friend was like, hey fam, wanna do something hilarious? Oh yeah, depending on like how the thing loses tracking, it can pull some very odd faces. <laughs> I'm not sure I've seen a mark on the side of the face so far. Francis? I don't think there was ever one called Francis. <laughs> I think he was called Jonah. There we go. We speedrun it? Yeah, because I fucked up the first time. Well, I didn't... No. I kind of fucked up. What happened is the game pulled some bullshit. And broke. Making tacos for dinner? Yummy. I'm very jealous. But yeah, this honestly this reminds me a little bit of like a combination of welcome to the game with phasmophobia, I guess. I don't know if you guys are feeling that. Oh no, now he's doing some bullshit! So both Harold and this nerd have done some nonsense. Ah, oh, crap. Who's it gonna be? Hey, Harold. Bye, Harold. Which makes me think it is actually Harold. I mean, Harold got the marks, though, whereas this guy hasn't got any marks. Jeepers, creepers, where'd you get those peepers? Wait, why can't I not do the peepers? Oh god, don't do it again. Jeepers, creepers, where'd you get them eyes? It won't let me do the things. No, I haven't seen any, like, non-scripted type wiggling at all. JT in the box, thank you for the sub. Welcome aboard, thank you, thank you. Uh, I can't interact with him anymore. Should I exit again? Is there a spook event that didn't resolve? Hello, spooks. Hello? Is this a spooky event that broke it last time too? I think so. Yeah, I can't interact with him now. Alright, hold on. Jeepers, creepers, where'd you get those peepers? Jeepers, creepers, where'd you get them eyes? <gasps> Hello, 
Nakuna Takage. What a wonderful name. <laughs> Maybe they won't count again, but... Like, I'm not sure what else I'm supposed to do other than restart it at that point. Hello. Let me fix the sensitivity. Again. There we go. Oh, no, I have to inspect his body again. All right. Is this really based off of real events? <laughs> what do you think? What does your heart tell you? Thank you for giving the gift of sub to Harold. Thank you, thank you. Oh. I didn't bother taking the man's tapes this time. I feel kind of bad about it. Because a lot of things are real? Yeah, exactly. We have to realize that there is there is no Santa, there is no Easter Bunny, and there is no Queen of England. having a good time. Oh, the bonitis is back. Could you do me a favor and not break this time? I don't like this event. It keeps crashing. Harold, you fucker! Every time. It's always you. <laughs> what have I still got? This one. I think it's Harold. Must I open that door? The event doesn't resolve until I do. It's kind of annoying that way. Like, the game is like, haha, you, you've made one of the classic blunders. And, like, is mean to you and triggers a spook event. But there's no way to get continue unless you do trigger the spook event. I guess other ways, if we didn't do that, then, you know, the, the game wouldn't have any spooks at all. Because you would be smart enough not to decide to fuck her with the ghost. Uh. Oh, I need a scalpel. No, c come on! Dude, the Herald event bugged it again. I Every time that happens, I can't interact with the body. Ah, uh, Really? That's such a bitch. Loop, thank you for the eight months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I 
I still kind of interact with him, so I do think every time Harold comes in and ruins my shit, then I don't I don't think I can interact with the body anymore. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure it didn't save again. I will try going out and back in, but I think I might be boned because it's gonna keep doing the Harold. Try checking on Harold. No, I don't want to give Harold what he wants. Harold's a bitch. Harold doesn't get my attention. It's like Harold's sitting there at tagging me like, Streamer! 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 <laughs> you don't reward that shit. Honestly, I am genuinely kind of tempted to just burn Harold if this breaks again. Where are we in the list of things? Oh, yeah, back to the initial examination. You know what? Harold's going in the drink. Heck you, Harold. I tried to play nice. We burn Harold. Oh, I need to... Wait. Oh, no, I can't burn him! I can't burn him because this fucker's stuck on the gurney. Ah. Uh... <sighs> I got... I got a VGS so I can get him off the stupid gurney. Stupid Harold. There we go. There we go. BGS! BGS! I guess if it happens again, I could try uh, reloading the game entirely again. Because I've had it work okay. When that event happens. Oh, hello again. <laughs> what exactly does that mean? Does it mean the demon is floating around like, hey? And if it does, why doesn't it go off when he's literally right on the gurney? There we go. What? I'm sh sewing his mouth shut so that he looks pretty for his funeral. All right. Uh, embalming fluid and pump. Also, isn't the game supposed to autosave more often than this? Why isn't it possible to manual save? I don't know. Am I the reason why the body's on the table? No! No! Why, why, why would I... Why would I do that? Do I look like the kind of person that would do this? I mean, if you mean, did I wheel the body over here? Then yes! But I didn't kill the person! <laughs> shown murdering psychopath tendencies. Apart from all those times that I killed all of my friends in every co-op game ever. Apart from all those times. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, that's a new one. Hey. It is immensely funny to me that most of the time you can actually ignore that ghost for some reason. <laughs> she just kind of stands there and she's like, please notice me. Doing the old slab squat. squat. She's just trying to learn. She wants to watch me work so she can learn. Uh... Bing, 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 there we go. What if I just ignore that? What? I don't actually know what she's uh wanting about there. I missed it entirely. Oh, I see. Oh, hey, what's happening over there? All good. Hello? This is different. Well. She zooshed. <laughs> get tubing by bed, get needle from bathroom, find lighter, get spoon, find full baggy. Do I have to? Oh, am I going to do drugs? Am I going to do drugs, chat? That's exciting. Is this for drugs? Get needle from bathroom. Uh... Imagine walking into a house and that list is just on the side. Because they, they keep forgetting how to do drugs. <laughs> just put that up there for a reminder. Uh, wait, where the fuck's the needle? Oh, oh, there it is. It's on the edge of the bathtub. What's the next one? Find lighter. It would be much easier if I could see shit. Is the lighter in the fridge? Oh, no, there it is. Uh, get spoon from coffee table. Spoon. Oh, look, it's all, it's all bent. Find full baggie on kitchen counter. Let me do some drugs real quick. Why do I still have my paper? Oh no, it's the girl from the ring! It's not been seven days? Oh no. What was I doing? Oh, the tank layer. Do I already have it? I do have it. Nice. Oh god, oh man. Mm, close. Do, 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 do. She's laughing? I don't know. I'm I'm a huge coward, but I'm having trouble taking this particular game seriously, and I don't know why. <laughs> It's a cool concept, so I'm glad I can play it, actually. Moisturizing. All right. I swear to God, every time you moisturize, something janky happens. Oh no, is this Harold? 
No, Harold, I almost finished it. Fuck. Come on. You bitch. Ugh. Why you gotta be like this, Harold? I was so close. Oh. But I finished it. I finished it, right? Is this where it breaks because Harold broke the embalming? You know what? I don't care. Oh, hey. <laughs> I don't care. I'm going to burn Harold. Like, saying that, this body moved about as much as Harold did, but I don't care. Poor Harold. He'll get over it. I cannot do a backup save. That's not how the game works. Yeah, Harold has demonic scratches, so... Harold gets the boot. Harold, also known as Justin... <laughs> The, the demon just giggled, so I might have hooked it up again. Achievement unlock speedrun? <gasps> I'm a speedrunner! What if speedrun is just like, resolve it no matter what? <laughs> it doesn't matter, you can just like, run in... Put a- dump a bunch of marks in and burn a body. <laughs> Good morning. It's nice not to be the one down there for a change. Uh, Raymond? I suppose a first name basis is in order. D did I make it? Is it over? For now. It's never really over. Same scene, Come but... Long way. Maybe it's I won't go... More, more, more. I am I'm demon. so glad I'm here. Uh -oh. I know it's disorienting. You'll get used to it. You should head home and get some rest. Every night can be different. Is it gonna be the I, same thing? I think I'm fine. Are you sure? Uh-oh. No, we're possessed again. <laughs> oh, I've just been <gasps> for so, so long. You what? burned the wrong body, you... Rebecca! You burned the wrong body. Rebecca. Rebecca's not here, you fucking idiot! Godspeed, Raymond. <laughs> and drink it as nuts from the pit of a brain. I don't understand why the game... Like, that seems silly. Why would the game force you to get all the symbols when, like, you can absolutely tell which demon it is based on the three symbols? Like, that seems kind of weird. Got the bonitis again.
Hmm. You think it might have been body three? But if, like... How are you supposed to tell which one is the bad one when all of it can be misdirects? I wonder. Because the demonic markings are the thing, but actually, no, demonic markings can be a bait. And actually, it's not demonic markings. I just have it in for Harold. I didn't burn Harold the first time! Did I? Did I burn Harold? No, I thought I burned body too. <laughs> Maybe it's total number of events? I don't have the attention span to remember everything that happens. Yeah. They just say you need to learn their name, but I did learn the name. I put the mark on. Harold did have the most events in the time that I was spending messing around with the bodies there. Hmm. Do we want to do another shift? Do we want to try and get it right? <laughs> Don't go O2 to demons. All right. Did I have fun? It is kind of funny. <laughs> Let's just burn Harold every time. I mean, it's one out of three. Surely, eventually, it'll be Harold, right? One of these days, it'll totally be him. I like how I got the speedrun achievement and was wrong, though. Like, you'd think you'd need to get it right to get the speedrun achievement. Because <laughs> as it is, I could just toss a bunch of random marks in there. Or sigils in there. And, and get an achievement. At least I can keep track of things. To banish a demon to hell, it must be bound to its chosen body and burned. The three objects in this cabinet are your tools. Oh. First, the clay tablet in the center is going to work. Yeah. Placing the smaller pieces in the correct configuration will spell the demon's name. Second, the bottles on the top shelf are a special reagent that will react to the mark. Add a bottle to the embalming mixture during the process. When the mark is placed on the correct body with the reagent inside, Force the demon to become bound to it. Pay attention to signs that you have chosen correctly. They can be obvious or extremely subtle. Once you are certain the demon is bound to its vessel, burn it. Finally, the pieces of paper on the right are called letting strips. It must Wait, is it implying that I should put the mark on the body and then look for signs? You will need to uncover these sigils. Is that what I'm doing wrong? Hold a letting strip up while wandering the mortuary. If it begins to smolder and burn, you're close. Because it said once, like, put the thing on the, th or... It said once you are certain, based on the signs, is that it? For combust, the sigil has been revealed somewhere in that area. They can be anywhere. So look on walls, under objects, inside furniture. Anywhere. The demon will inscribe its sigils over time to try and hide them. So check regularly. Once you uncover the sigils, use the night shift database to decide which demon you're dealing with, and use that knowledge to create the mark. The steps are crazy. Crabs, this is a totally different save file. To the mixture, uncover the hey, sigils, you're starting early. Build the mark and place it on the body. <laughs> she looks like Helena Bonham Carter there. <laughs>
babe. Uh. Oh, I forgot the name. No, she gave the there we are, so I didn't get... Or I didn't miss anything. It's just that, uh... I forgot to put the name on the sheet. No! How many people in chat actually own a printer, though? Like, I feel like that's the question to ask before how fast is it? <laughs> if I could have a cat, what cat would I get? Uh... Ragdoll. Wait, why wouldn't it comply with their policy? For, for gasms. I don't think anyone's making an orgasm face here. That would be very weird. <laughs> Hi, Arizona! You are? Oh. It's about time for a spook event. When's it gonna happen? Getting marks, like I'm just using the two, the three that I get to deduce the fourth. Eight, eight, five, three. remember what the first one was? <laughs> Hi, Tane! The first symbol was an H? Oh, thank you! at this time? Looks like it hurts. Good thing she's dead. There we go. Wasn't that like a, the plot of a movie where... Oh wait, no, wasn't it a house episode where everyone thought that they were dead, but they weren't? I don't remember. <gasps> oh no. Will you help me? No. No. 
okay. A small photo. Year of arrival at the house of death, the birth of its creator, the full number shall be six. What? Okay. I can't hold anything else. Oh no, what have I already got? Oh, I have the moisturizing pet. Fuck. I can't use that here. Drop. I didn't close that. <laughs> um... You notice that the man is bleeding during the autopsy. Ooh. Was the demon holding a phone? No, it's probably me holding this card. Um. All right. this plastic bag used for storing the ashes of cremated bodies oh that's interesting but if i cremate then the game's over suspicious hmm what could it mean Oh, wait, no, aren't there matches in the other room? Can I do something dicky? <gasps> Harold! Buddy! You behave yourself, Harold. Uh, that very briefly ignited. <gasps> Where could it be? No. What's that? Hmm. Hmm, maybe the bathroom. Oh, where are those matches? Yeah. Oh, it's one left. <sighs> so there's one left. I mean, can you even see the sigils if you're not possessed? It might be that you cannot. <gasps> is that- that is a demonic symbol! Harold, is it you again? Except not, actually? <laughs> oh, they just turned off the lights in there. Could you not? There we go. 
His name is Carlton Cummings. This time. We all know his name's actually Harold. Harold, what the fuck are you doing? I heard that. You doing some weird shit in here, buddy? Can I do like some weird? I can't use that here. I'm missing something. Like, I have matchsticks. I can't use that here. I can't use that here. Hmm. Chat, what on earth are you doing? Fingers or feet moving? Not that I've seen. But he has, he has the demon's marks. <laughs> what if I just get enough sigils every time and just burn Harold until it's right? <laughs> there we go. I wonder if the game doesn't let you actually complete it until you have all the sigils, though. That, that would be silly, though, right? Right. This is the full game, yeah. You guys do think you have to leave the mark on them? Should we listen to it the way he phrases it again? To banish a demon to hell, it must be bound to its chosen body and burned. The three objects in this cabinet are your tools. First, being darker and darker in there. In the is called a mark. Placing the smaller pieces in the correct configuration will spell the demon's name. Second, the bottles on the top shelf are a special reagent that will react to the Add a bottle to the embalming mixture during the process. When the mark is placed on the correct body, with the reagent inside, it will force the demon to become bound to it. Yeah, it says pay attention to signs that you've chosen correctly. So I think I absolutely need to put the mark on the body and then watch it. Like, I think it digging around on the gurney is not necessarily the problem, or the, the, what I'm looking for. I need, I need to put the mark on before that happens. Yeah, you can't do it unless you put the chemical in. Oh no, are we doing drugs again? Anywhere. The demon will inscribe oh, the signals over time to try and hide them. So check regularly. Once you uncover the sigils, use the night shift database to decide which demon you're dealing with. Place. And you use that knowledge to find the mark. We're heading down to the beach. The step is to grab your kit and get down here. You can't say those words, sir. Uncover the sigils. Build the mark and place it on the body. Then, when you're certain, I'm missing something. Burn it in the retort. Um. I'm missing something. What did he tell me to do? Oh, it's my heroin kit. I always need those. That, even. Oh no, the goo! Hey. You did 
this to me is all your fault. <laughs> it is, it is, it's all my fault. Looking pretty possessed. Turning the lights off, you dicks. I can't see. Oh. Uh, the light switch is gone. Uh. There it is. It's hidden. Never mind. We're good. Okay. Empty reservoir bag. This in here. It's okay, I'm sure this time we'll get it right first try. I misunderstood the game mechanics. He did say to replay the tapes, but after I got a demonic message on them, I kind of stopped playing them because it was annoying. <laughs> There we go. There we go. Ooh, seek. Okay. So we've got what? An L. The Japanese symbol. <laughs> Um, what was the last one? The H, I guess. Oh, he was totally under the thing there. <laughs> Didn't even notice him. It was like, oh, hey. And then I need to moisturize the body. I can't use that here. All right. I swear, every time you moisturize a body, someone kicks off in the mortuary. Bing, 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 bing. We have three signs now, yeah. Come on, Mr. Cummings. Couldn't I... Okay, so does anyone... Does anyone know for sure if I can skip the fourth sigil just by deducing it? Because I feel like I should be able to, but the game's being a bitch, and I can't tell. Like, presumably you'd get a different ending cutscene if you just named the demon wrong. Because it does specifically say you chose the wrong body. So maybe I've gotten the name right every time, but it's just that I'm fucking up the body thing because I didn't understand how that works. Uh, so it was a B... An L... B L. Mm. A B. Okay, I fucked up because I don't see it in like any of them. <laughs> wait, was it this B? Was it this? Oh wait, no, it was an H, wasn't it? So it's probably this. Oh, let me go double check. Oh, I didn't put you back in. I'm sorry, buddy. There you go. Uh... Okay, so it's not got the, the mark on the underneath. It's on the left. Oh, you can't see the cursor being rendered? That sucks. <laughs> so it's not that symbol.
Was it this one? It was this one, for sure. And this one, I think? <gasps> it's this one, it's Telduck. Okay, so... And then L. And the last one was the weird squiggly. <laughs> the weird squiggly. Like that's not all of it. Oh, but I still I still need to do the final body, really, don't I? Because I need to make sure. But I'm a little sus of Harold again. So I'm just going to quickly put a mark on him. And see what happens. Are you sure this is the right one? Stop talking. Do you mean, like, do I ever not use the VTuber thing? No, not really. Oh. <laughs> okay. This body is fully embalmed, yes. I can't use that here. How does the matchbox work, here. then? Oh. Harold. Harold. <laughs> okay, bye. Harold back on his bullshit again. Uh oh. No. Oh, am I going to rehab? But I said no, no, no. I miss you so much. I don't care about anything. I don't want to be you. But I have pictures of me on my Please. YouTube or Twitter. I think you're misunderstanding the point of the whole VTuber thing. I love you. Oh, the screaming man? I'm glad we finally met him. Eels. Rebecca Owens, take once a day with food. Because I am sad. Gotcha. MG, isn't that fairly high? I guess it depends on what's been prescribed. <laughs> yeah, I think it's dependent on what's being subscribed. Uh, subscribed, prescribed. Don't mind me, just subliminally messaging. How about that subscribing, eh? Don't forget to like and subscribe. Really helps me out. Where the frick am I going? 
I'm not scared, I'm just confused. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Blue Spike, thank you for gifting 10 subs to the community. Thank you very, very much. Really helps me out. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Oh my god, it worked. Whoop, 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 whoop. Oh, it's me again. Hey. I'm sitting here holding your coin right now. Wondering if I'll ever have one of my own. What would the point even be? Even if one day I'm sitting here holding my own, no matter how many years are printed on it, I would still always have yours in my other hand, never changing stuck forever. It would always remind me of the life I cut short while I keep going. I can't imagine it. My dad's sobriety coin. My dad's necklace. Dun dun dun. You should have died when you had the chance. I couldn't pick up the coins, for what it's worth. She okay? Doing great. Oh yeah, we're dealing with this bullshit, I forgot. Alright, Harold. From the top. Is that new? That might be new. How do I burn Harold? Like, as in, like, use the matchstick on him? No, the lightning's always been there. <laughs> eh. Okay, so he said something when the thing was put on him. And it went funky when I picked up his arm, but that's probably scripted. So, I guess I will take my mark back. Good sir. If you don't mind. I'm trying to figure out how to use matches on Harold. <laughs> oh, that's not looking good. There's one left, and I want- I want to put- I want to use it on Harold, but the game's like, nah. So, mask. Yeah, I don't know how to do it. I kind of just want to burn whichever body is Harold's every single time and see how it goes. <laughs> I guess I'll do the last one. Unless, can I put it on this one for a little bit? She doesn't seem all that bothered. But, the body I burned the first save file said, Are you sure that's the right one? And it wasn't, so... <laughs> oh! <gasps> the fourth symbol! <sighs> it is that one. Okay, let's do this ship properly. Oh no, I need the mark back. Give it! Give me my mark back! Ah, oh, crap. Give it! No! No! Lady! Lady! Give me my mark back! Thank you. <laughs> oh, God help me. 
I mean, I am pretty far down on the possession scale here. I'm starting to get a little bit worried about completing this one in time because I've been dicking around. God can't help me now? No, I suppose not. <laughs> oh, Grandma! No can do, sweaty. <laughs> Fuck off, Grandma. I'm busy. <laughs> Don't you love your grandma? Absolutely not. <laughs> it's so cold out here. I'd love to come in. Let me in, Rebecca. No. Grandma, please leave. <laughs> no. All right. Uh. Let's see. Potato. Rotato. Ooh. Found a thing. Found a thing. Found a thing. There we go. I mean... Presumably, you don't actually have to embalm all the bodies to win, so maybe there's something weird I can do. Uh, what am I doing? Oh. Entry three. Burn one until you win. No, because I have to get the symbols right. I can't skip that much. It would be funny, though. I assume I don't need the paper anymore, but I'm going to take it for giggles. No, if you were supposed to put the mark and then use the reagent, you would just lose very early on. That doesn't seem right. Hey. Okay. <laughs> I am smoke now. Oh, that's probably not good. Um, this is the most possessed I've ever been. Isn't that exciting? I already have one of those. Oh. There we go. Right. I'm starting to remember the steps. It... yeah, I mean, if I run out of time, I can just pick Harold again. <laughs> Uh, nope, not that one. Uh, scalpel? And this thing. How do we know we out of time? I don't know. Hey. Splurt. Stop opening the doors. Yeah, I, I figured the demon would possess me. I just... I feel like it's been quicker this time. Maybe the more you do with the bodies, the more you get, like, possessed. As well as the time.
What if I just put the mark on the body the entire time here? Yay. So far, I feel like Harold's the only one that's reacted to this thing. Are they the correct symbols? Pretty sure. I'm missing something. Oh, what did I pick that was wrong? E. No bugging out this time? Maybe? Every time I have to go to the bathroom here, I just assume something bucky is going to happen. I don't think you have to leave the sigil on it while I'm bombing. That would be weird. Because otherwise, like... For for three of the bodies, you wouldn't have all of the... the sim oh, sorry. Two of the bodies, maybe, you wouldn't have all of the symbols in the thing. So that would be weird, because you, you only get the symbols after a certain point. The sigils, even. This body seems okay. I haven't seen anything happen to it. the friggin' matchbox. Yeah, nobody has had any kind of feet or finger movement, and it's really bothering me. Like, how am I supposed to tell? see shit now. What the fuck, game? <laughs> there. Oh, well, that's awkward. Did you stop? It's just a little possession. It's still good. Where'd the mark go? Don't worry about it. It's probably fine. Oh no, I can't get to the doors. <sighs> it's just a mild case of bonitis. Where'd the mark go? <laughs> oh, we're stuck in an event. <sighs> what do you want? What do you, what what are you po you pointing at this? Yes. Okay, good. Great. Can I open the doors now? We hope you have a great time. <gasps> Little Kuribo, thank you for the raid. Welcome, welcome everyone. We hope you have a great time. Thank you, thank you. Uh, don't mind the bonitis on my patient. We're gonna fix it. <laughs> welcome to the channel. Thank you for raiding. My name is Limes and I'm confused. 
Uh, she seems to be stuck in the boat, I suppose. I don't know what to do with her now. I think it bugged again. Like, where, where's where's the mark? <laughs> the mark is despawned. Oh, I'm God. I am missing something. This is awful. <laughs> Uh-oh. Hello? I think I might be a little bit possessed. Is she okay? Maybe? <laughs> I'd like my mark back, please. Oh, God. <laughs> Real girl, thank you for the hundred bits. Thank you, thank you. I'm so confused. Can I just do this and reset her? Oh god! Just just pretend it didn't happen. It's fine. Give me my mark! <laughs> oh god. Uh hmm. What am I supposed to do here? Okay, you broke everything. <laughs> The, the, the demon... I think the demon won. Like... I, I don't think there's anything I can fix here. Reset game again? Oh god, okay, hold on. She's cl she is clipping through her own underwear. <laughs> I just wanna win a game. I just wanna win a game. You hate it when that happens. <laughs> if after playing this game you experience abnormal happenings around your home. <laughs> it's saying I only embalm too. Again. I'ma cry. <laughs> I don't know if there's a cure for her bonitis. It's one of the most severe cases I've ever seen. Hello again. Are you- are you shitting me? Okay, no. It, it didn't save after I put him back. I'm pretty tempted to just- I'm pretty tempted to just toss Harold in there, if I'm honest. Like... Put the mark on her again, <laughs> but it went horribly wrong. If I just burn Harold every single time, it'll eventually be correct. Hey, buddy. Wait, where'd my mark go? D don't. Don't. Where's my mark? Where's my mark? Where's my mark? Where's my mark? Okay. I'm missing something. I'm, I'm I'm missing something. No, wait. What do you mean? I'm missing something. I'm missing something. I'm 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 missing something. <sighs> Just wanted to finish the game. I just wanted to finish the game! Tyler Dibbles, thank you for the 100 bits. Thank you very, very much. I'm depressed. I'm missing something. I, I, I'm missing something. Why can I pick that up? Wait, wh why can I pick that up? I'm, I'm, I'm missing something. And... <laughs> I'm I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I
Like, if it was just that the symbols were missing, I'd be able to go to the symbols section and, and put the symbols in. But I cannot do that. <laughs> because I'm missing something. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The door's open. Oh. I'm missing something. I hate this game. I'm missing something. <laughs> I'm very possessed. I'm, I'm, I'm missing something. I'm missing something. It seems to have completely I'm reset the mark something. because it got absorbed into Rebecca. I'm missing something. <laughs> Alright, let me do a full reset. And then if that doesn't work, I'm going to scream. And, and also stop playing. <laughs> And I'm not digging around with the lighting anymore. Because it's tedious. The mortuary assistant! I'm missing something! I think, for whatever reason, when I quit, even though it doesn't save, for some reason it saves certain things, and one of the things that it saves is whether or not my mark got absorbed into her chest cavity. <laughs> breaths. I'm missing something. How do I how do I leave? No, don't use the don't use the fucking door. Don't use the door. Get in your car and press the pedal and go. No, I don't have everything because I'm missing something. <laughs> Fuck you, checklist. <laughs> oh, I can't do anything. <laughs> I guess I'm missing something. Oh. <laughs> Oh, the demon. Thank you for the 666. The demon... <laughs> the demon stole my car keys. Fuck off! <laughs> I am so done. <laughs> I'm missing something. <laughs> Stop it. You know what? The only way out of this purgatory is to just burn a body without the sigil on it. I'm pacing. Wait. I... Yeah, no, yeah, fuck it, I'll burn... Wait, but wait, hold on. If it's memorized where the sigil was, do you think she'll still count as having the sigil on her? <laughs> Or do you think I should just burn Harold for the funnies? Yeah, fuck it, Harold. Into the flame. <laughs> Check her first. It's too late. No, she doesn't have it. Ask me if I give a fuck. No, no, I burned. I burned the second one in the on the first batch. I burned Harold the second time though. No, how would I get the same ending? Because I didn't bother using the mark this time. Why would the demon climb out? That wouldn't make any sense. It's gonna fucking do it, isn't it? 
That doesn't make any sense. Why is the demon there? He's not bound to the body. That's stupid. That's stupid. This is stupid. <laughs> <laughs> hate this Good game. Morning. Good morning. It's nice not to be the one down there. For uh huh. Really? Rebecca's not here, you stupid well, I idiot. A first name basis is in order. I feel fine. D did I make it? Is it over? I've been waiting oh so no. long. It's never really over. You've come a long way. It's a lot to learn. <clears throat> I'm so glad I'm here. I know it's disorienting. You'll get used to it. <laughs> you should head home and get some rest. Every night can be different. I think I'm fine. Rebecca, you burned the wrong body. I didn't even burn the sigil, dude. Oh, I've just been waiting <laughs> for so, so long. What? What are you... No, you didn't use the mark. Rebecca. Oh, he has one I one different line. You didn't use the mark. I would have used the mark if you had let me. And drink it as nuts from the pit of brain. Splurp. Split. Ha ha ha. God, I want, I want, I want it to work just out of sheer fucking stubbornness. <laughs> but... I don't know if I have the will. I'm missing something. Like the first, the first couple were probably, no, the first one broke and didn't give me the fourth sigil, which might have goofed everything. The second time, I misunderstood the instructions, so that's my fault. The third time, fuck you, game. <laughs> it's not my fault this time. Do, 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 do. Oh, yeah, no, that does feel bad. Villanorix, thank you for the 38 million months. It, it, it does feel bad. I don't legitimately hate the game. If, if the dev happens to be watching, I don't hate the game. It's... <laughs> it's for the bit. But, uh... I'm missing something. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. No, it's still ending three. Ah. How do we even get the other endings? I wonder I wonder who they're referring to. With that tweet, though, because it could be, it could be someone else entirely, because it was like an hour and a half ago, or two hours, two hours ago. So it could be someone else that's gotten some ridiculous bugs, or maybe the same bugs as me. Oh god, do I want to try again. Maybe, maybe we should leave it and come back to it in a couple of days when the, there's been a couple of bug passes because it looks like the dev is, is fixing a bunch. I could just start a new shift and see if maybe, maybe that uncurses it. But yeah, no, I, th I think, I think it might be a good idea to wait because I am clearly breaking something. 
I wouldn't be surprised if it was something specific like, oh, running the game at 90 FPS causes some weirdness with the with everything. No, you can hit, there's a skip tutorial button. I wouldn't know how to get the quicker endings. Personally. Wait, what happens? What happens if I arrive and then just immediately leave? Like, what happens if I take my car keys, I arrive in my car, and then I go back in my car and my and I leave? No, I want. I want to go. Oh, Dis got a bunch of bugs. Dis is good at finding bugs. Oh look, a building. Goodbye. Why can I even get back in my car? If leaving isn't an option. I don't have my clipboard. <laughs> I can absolutely leave if I complete the shift successfully, but it's not the point. I want to get an ending where I just don't don't engage. That's annoying. Keys to the mortuary. What is the point in that? At least I can keep track of things. <clears throat> <Thank you. laughs> I, yeah, I know. I, I don't think I can do another full run again. It's too depressing. <laughs> I tried so many times and the game just doesn't want to play ball. Yeah, seriously, where's, where are my keys? There, there has... The fact it lets me get back in the car means there has to be a way to just leave. What happens if I just chill here? <laughs> I can't use that here. Yeah, no, it would feel really bad. Like, you're like, okay, everything seems to be working great. I haven't had a bug in ages on my particular computer, and then boom. I wanted to set the car on fire. I wanted to honk the horn. I can't use that here. <clears throat> Why will you not let me leave? I'll get fired like I get fired! Did you successfully burn anything yet, Donut? <laughs> As in, like, the right thing? I am repeatedly not doing that. Once? Nice! Nice. I, I cannot get that far. <laughs> By luck. I thought I was gonna do it. I thought I was gonna get it right, and then... And then, I don't know if you saw, but I put the mark on a girl to test. And she contorted and absorbed the mark into her own body. And it broke so hard that when I reloaded the game, the mark could no longer be interacted with. <laughs> I just want to set fire to everything. 
I still don't know what this is all about. Oh, you can't actually pick that up. Okay, so there's this, yeah. Wait, if you reload, the bodies can just go, hey, not the right one? Wait, so if you know for sure which one it is and then you reload, it can actually break which one it is? That would explain a lot because I reloaded a bunch of times. That might explain why I've always been wrong. <laughs> oh, that I understand so much now. But that's... The, I don't think that would be intentional because if it was like anti-save scumming, that wouldn't make any sense because it would invalidate all the clues so far. And the game should just not allow you to save if that's how it wants to play it because the clues shouldn't reset mid-game. I'm very confused. I'm confused and distressed. I don't- I don't know how to feel anymore. <laughs> also, I've just received an email telling me that my my Gmail storage is 71% full. That is genuinely pretty impressive. I didn't even know that I could do that. Like... I've- I've never heard of a- of an inbox filling up like that. <laughs> Oops. Oh well. Okay, so... So, so, for game one, it bugged out, stopped giving me sigils, and potentially I might not have been able to pick a body anyway because it kind of got a bit goofy. So I burned Harold. Game two, I didn't understand how the mark was supposed to work and that you were only supposed to get the signs once you put the mark on them. So I burned the wrong body based on stuff that was just happening, which is probably scripted events. My bad. Game three. She melded with the mark, and I'm missing something. Alright, cool, I had a fun time. 